heck is that? Stump something. Yeah, da, da, da. is this? Is this just like crazy interference or like what is going on? What is the deal? Yo. Yo. <laughs> yeah, we're out here. Phil is on a microphone running live scope on somebody else's boat on an Ultrax. What is going on? <clears throat> we got up somebody out there. Oh, you got it running off of my phone? Yeah, my, my camera was like this bad, but yours is like that like perfect crystal clear. Oh, yeah. Yeah, your camera sucks. Just think, with all the money you've spent on fishing this year so far, you could have bought two new phones. You have nobody to blame but yourself. <laughs> Where? What? Oh, now you want to fish? What do you know about that spot? What do you know, Thomas? Tell me. I just know that this could be a spawning creek. 
So in theory, there should be. All right, where do you want to go? Hello, Earth to Thomas. Head all the way across there. Like across the channel. That That's bank. Right yep. All right. Why? Why are we doing that? Uh, it's a really good spawning flat. Um, say no more. Oh, righty, guys. So what we're going to be doing today is we might catch a fish, we might not. We are here on the res. Uh, me, no one gives a shit about me, though. But this guy right here, the man called Phil, we have only one cable that will charge uh, the mics. And so we only have one working mic right now at this point. I'm charging the other one up. So if you want to ask Phil questions, though, or you want to talk to Phil, I have a secondary phone, which is my phone, because the camera's shit on it. But I can actually listen to your, see your questions, and I'll have uh, Phil ask them or answer them. <laughs> He'll be doing something. All right. We are live on the water, boys. Wonder uh how you long how long you think it's going to take this thing to die? <laughs> <laughs> take some bets on uh yeah there is a side pot going we already have 10 people watching see like they're busting on top over there huh? something's pushing shad up i just don't know if i have the balls to throw the top water right now I got, I got, I'm throwing top water. you are Same. Same. <laughs> Same. <laughs> see if I can see what's going on. Huh? Uh, I'm just looking on live scope to see if yeah, there's any. Ignore it, ignore it. Well, I'm seeing if there's any fish under those fish. It's it's really a, really an issue. I'm about to turn it off. Yeah. Well, I'm just not used to that many information inputs. What? I am the instinctual angler. You've seen my boat. There's not even a map. I don't even have an atlas. Find another 23 year old that knows what an atlas is. Sure. I got something else. So. We got a lot of log jams in here. You could really wreck your Jerry on that one. Bum -ba -bum -ba -bum -ba -bum -ba -bum. Speed. I am speed.
Yeah, you should have seen how it was before I started straightening it up when you got in the truck to go to the ramp. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. Ask a question when a prize. Ask a question, I'll throw you a random soft plastic out of the bottom of my boat. Are you allowed to pee on live stream? I don't have to right now. I'm just figuring out the groundwork, you know? Facts. And we got a little crowd over here. Thought we might have uh, the ramp area to ourselves. One there, one there. Yeah, guys. Gonna... Everybody else. And honestly, I think we should play the disabled card. Be like, hey, look. Like when someone pulls into the handicap parking spot. Yeah. Oh. Where you want us to be? Yeah. We have a disability. Right. We are handicapped in more ways than one. Tug, you ripped a burnout on the ramp this morning. I was just laughing. You were so amped up. Now, why Ask does... Ask a question with a prize. If one of, what lure are you throw, throwing first? Uh, so, here, say this question here. So, say these questions out loud. <sighs> Good morning. What lure are you throwing first? What's your goal for weight? Uh, weight? Five keepers. Six. Or, oh, we can bring six? Six keeper limit. No way. Bait? Fish everything? TS10. Brought to you by Phil. Brought to you by Phil. Um, and Sleeper Crawl. And uh, Thomas will show you what he's throwing here shortly. I'm throwing a, I got a swim jig tied on. I think I can the camera. Guys, I'm charging a mic already. Got to show the camera, dog. Uh, White swim jig. We are in four feet right now. I'm trying to see. Oh my gosh. I have. <laughs> I have a huge follower. <laughs> I have a huge fish behind my bait. But you keep slamming lids. Thomas, that was legit. Like, I legit had a big fish behind me. Seriously? Yes. No kidding.
I don't know much, but I do know what that looks like. It's not 15 inches. Don't scare the people at home. Where's that? Yeah, honestly. I love doing that. Yeah, but we have poles and 18 million rods and 30 million Ned rigs. Can't see my glide bait. There you are. No, but that fish that followed, he wasn't even off the point. Not in the middle of nowhere, he was in the gut. I can't believe I'm giving up all the juicy secrets online. <laughs> all my, all my juicy secrets that I'm catching fish on right now. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. Yeah, this is literally like the first 20 casts that I've ever taken in this body of water. Looks good though. <laughs> yes, Virginia. You can. Yeah. 
All right, let's turn you down. Let's go looking. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? I seen you. Just seen a shad pop up behind you. What? Seen a shad pop up behind you. Gets me every time. I guess we're a team. <laughs> this is just Thomas's tackle organization day. This just what are you be doing? Huh? What'd you say? Oh. She do be muddy. Said she do be muddy though. I guess this isn't even really actually a lake, is it? It is a lake actually. Well, I mean, like a dammed up river, like the CBS. I mean, it's just a stepchild of the Potomac. Ian brings mermaids? I mean, you know. I had a dollar for every time you said that at Smith. Yeah. I'd be, we'd, we'd be fishing out of a John boat rig right now. What we got? Bro, you're doing tackle. I'm fishing. Yeah, but they can't hear me. I don't like. Oh, no, I'm just saying, ask me the questions. You don't even use 360 Yeah, no, honestly, I can turn that off, save battery. Or just hold it, yeah. Uh, does Phil know the tournament rules or is he just winging it? What is what does the tournament rules have anything to do with winging it? But yes, I'm I'm just winging it. Um, clutch your KGB better. 
clutch or KGB. Um, I don't know. I haven't fished either of them. Oh, he was asking me what swim baits I like. <laughs> DMV Bronze Back Yakker wants to know how much longer until you're done prepping. Uh, ten minutes. Ten minutes, he says. Where are you guys fishing at? The Riz. Yes. Hunter! Um, be interesting if there was a mic in the water. Oh, apparently my mic's picking up a lot of your noise. Uh, I can't help no, don't, don't apologize. I'll try to get everyone. Yeah, I think that's everything. All right. Back to business. Uh, water temperature is 51. Oh, yeah. Testing to, oh sweet baby Jesus. I got a mic, let's fucking go. Let's go. Guys, again, this is not part of the podcast. There is gonna be some mature rated uh, words said. Hunter said, if Thomas takes a cast before 9 a.m. I owe you $50, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't have said anything. Uh, it's sad, but it's true. Sad, but true. Tom didn't get to bed till 12, Shout out getting to everything right. Yeah, Thomas didn't get to bed until 12. Thomas is an old man. No, that's what young men do. You're, oh. You're Wait, out man. of your element. See, I'm so I'm like Joe Biden. Is that right? The, is, is that the, huh? the uh, strikles? I think so. Slow down, slow down. Let's hit the bank. Let's hit the bank first. Um, hit the bank first. They're not on the bank. So let's hit the bank first. They're not on that bank, at least. <laughs> they might be on that one. Here, send this. I'm sure there are on that one. Here, I'm gonna move some rods around. Take this. Oh, sorry, I'm. I can't. I'm. What are you talking about? I'm. I'm trying to fish, dog. How deep is it? It is nine foot. Nine foot? Mm-hmm. I'll check that mic out. Wee! Oh shit! I almost got snagged. I think they're shallow. No, I definitely do too, but I'm just... But you're like, you know what? Looking at some different things that... This is the first time the baby's had the crack of the scope, so... I've run into... <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> but it's the first time I've ever, like... Not ever, but really ran it. I don't know. I don't normally feel comfortable running other people's boats, but for some reason I'm totally fine with Aww. it right now. It's because it's, it's crap. <laughs> yeah, I've run a lot of boats than this. Yeah, make it do the thing. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Turn this off for a minute. I, already, I thought I already turned that off. Guess not. There we go. Phil, did you get sleep since Friday? Uh, why last Why last live tourney? This is cool. It's not, okay, R Ray, I'm sorry. It's not the last one. I, I've i always wanted to do live tournaments, but it's all about um, your cell service <laughs> because I don't have a $100,000, uh, like whatever the, what, what is it the MLF has? Case in point, I messed up the title because I did this in the boat. But yeah, we're gonna do way more of these. I think Phil and I, depending on how this goes, we might do a lot of these and just plan on a live I'm stream. Try to. I was actually before this was even a thing. I was thinking about getting into another drone, but this year, 
Yeah. Uh, I will say, though, to do a live stream, it's kind of nice to have this bigger platform because of all the camera. Oh, there's fish right there. I know. There's fish all over this thing. Oh, did I, I powered us down. Let me try something. Well, I'm just turning it. I'm just <sighs> taking a look see. Where are they? I think. Johnny asked if I got any sleep since Friday. How did you know I've been on a bender for the past half of a week? Johnny, but yes, I actually finally did get some sleep for once. Feeling good this morning. There's one right there. Fish. <laughs> Look at you go. Look at you go. Oh, so we so need, cute. just to give you guys a reminder, if you fit on the upper Potomac, this is probably a keeper or a kicker on the upper Potomac. Uh, it'll take about 40 pounds for six fish to win here, and I think it's like a 15-inch limit. So, <laughs> yep. it's kind of sad. Yeah. Uh, and I'm sorry I said last tournament ever, guys. I can't, about that. I can't spell, especially under last pressure. Last tournament. Especially ever. under pressure. <laughs> Who knows? It may be our last tournament ever. You never know. Here you go. Things can, a, lot of, a lot of daylight left. Here you go. You don't have to use your teeth. I'll be using here. Seven feet, yeah. Water temperature. Did you already tell them the water temperature? Yeah. No, good question. I mean, generally speaking, I have gotten, so in college, I fished extremely fast. Um, and then as I got out of college, I started to fish slower and learn to pick things apart because I want to be able to do both. And honestly, because we cannot go anywhere and run spots, we're going to treat this like a Japanese angler and we're going to name every stump in here. And what's funny is because we can power pull down and these fish are coming shallow, we can just power pull down and just live scope. It's like, it's like a, well, not just live scope, but we can just hit a lot of this stuff here. What was the question? It's like, are we going to be burning spots? It's oh. like, well. As much as we can. I don't know how we could. I mean, it's all relative, you know? <laughs> <laughs> True. <laughs> But no, with this water clarity and our motor situation. I think that's the bigger situation. <laughs> well, He's going to give some professional, like, you know, because of the barometric pressure and this and that. Oh, we don't have an outboard. But besides that. Uh, I'm just saying it wouldn't, I don't think it would uh, do us a whole lot of good anyways to run and gun super hard today. There's actually a boatload of fish back up in there. Hold on. Cast like that tree. He's coming to it. I think we're going to get on something today. Mm-hmm.
I know we're gonna be proud of our like three fish or like our ten pound limit with six, and we're gonna. Get... It's gonna be like that meme with the guy that's in like tenth place, smashing a. Dude, we got you. See him? Yeah. You want to try? Why don't you throw that uh, the big dog? I'm right on him. Always the gamble with the fish that are off the bank. Sometimes they're off the bank because they don't want to eat. Well, that's what's so funny, Ed, Edwin. Um, I don't really know how to use live scope. I am not savvy. <laughs> Me neither. And Phil doesn't own one. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Don't even. But all, all I'm doing right now is I'm power pulled down in the gut of this pocket and we're just going to fish completely around the boat, up power pole and keep going. Which generally when I get to a new place, it's kind of like I do is just camp in area and catch one to figure out what they're biting before you start hauling butt. Because if you're not throwing the right thing, you're covering water, like you're not, I don't know, I feel like you're going to fish over fish. No, yeah, there's, there's fish all over the lake. It's not like they're all in one pocket. Yeah, it's, it's just an interesting thing. Like, if you knew the jerk bait was working like hot, you wouldn't spend too much time in an area, because you'd be like, well, clearly they're not biting it. So it comes right. down to like the yeah. belief. Depth of water. The depth of water is seven feet. Well, I think it would be hilarious if like half the competitors stop fishing and just watch us. That's really what I'm hoping for. That's our strategy. <laughs> It'd be a huge waste of their time. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a it's like a defensive tactic. We take our pants off and we're like, what the hell are they doing? They just stop and watch us. Yeah. And then we win with 15 pounds. Yeah. Oops. Sorry, boys. Yeah. Weren't expecting that, were you? Drop shot ready to go. We'll do spinning rods here. We'll do bait casters there. And I'm gonna throw on a Ned rig, guys, and I'm actually completely done rigging for this five seconds. My God, that bait scared me. Which lake today? We are on the Aquan Reservoir. Is Phil cold without a rain suit? Nope. Just my heart. Oh, that's hurtful. But, but he is single. I am single. So, you know, you if know, you're in the chat. I'm a sweetheart. Our biggest hope today, guys, is Jake to get Jake said him. your bibs are hot. Thanks. They are. Whoa. What are you doing out there, Jerry? Is that a fish? Is that a bogey? bogey. <laughs> Throw a big dong. Well, I'm trying to just see a few things. A couple of things. I do have a glide bait, guys, but I don't know how much I'll throw it since I have the master in the boat. Feels kind of dumb to try to shoot a basketball when you have LeBron James in the boat. <laughs> oh, man. Huh? I said, oh man, don't put that pressure on me. To be fair, I've caught one on a spinning rod. <laughs> right. That's the one reason I kind of like this bigger screen, honestly. Got one. <laughs> That's a keeper. 
Battle Keep. Probably. Yeah! Let's go, boys! What was that on? Swim jig. Nice. Dirty jig, California swim jig. This is one of my favorites. I don't fish. I fished a chatterbait six times in my life, and I forgot my spinnerbait box because I am 90% wrong all the time on what's going to work. And I said, you know what? Spinnerbait's in a month. the size limit here. Now, what we're going to do, guys, if you like this kind of stuff, next time we're going to bring beers. And every time we catch one, we're going to actually shotgun one for you. I love how you said that so professionally. <laughs> actually, everyone wants me to fish the BFL. This is fine, man. We got live service here. I'll fish these and I'll be a happy man. We don't oh, have to yeah. fish anything else. Payouts are better, too. I think. Probably. All right. Well, I think we're going to be okay, guys. They're going to hit what Tommy likes. I appreciate it, Johnny, but I'm good. I've got a. Uh... A flannel on under this hoodie, and I got my vest, and Let's then back that way. I got sweatpants on under my jeans. Dude, he smoked that thing. Yeah, that was sick. Dude, he just slacklined me. So they're shallow. That was on the was bank. It? Oh, yeah. it was like right up. It in was it. on the yeah. bank. Honestly, let's do this. Turn the scope off. Yep. This was the tournament that we were created for, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. I don't know why I'm trying to change it up now. And this is another nice thing about having a big boat. Like everyone's like John boats and stuff. And I'm, I'm doing this and I'm being tongue in cheek and I'm joking, by the way, because I know YouTube is so forgiving for this. But we can, behind us, this looks very clean. Like we have three rods. It's a shit show in the back. But that way, you know, we both have room. No, is it? We turning everything off. All power is going to the trolling motors. <laughs> Luckily, oh, I will say, guys, I do have plenty of batteries. Nice. What did you catch uh, that with? I caught it with a uh, dirty jig swim jig. It's a California jig because the California swim jig has a bigger hook on it, so you can really stick into them. But then I put a massive Kitek on the back of white, and it's going to sheet white. And I throw this on. Um, Basically, this is my swim jig setup. 90% of the time is a uh, Phoenix extra fast tip heavy rod with 18 pound fluorocarbon. But I will go down to a finesse setup of a medium light extra fast tip with 15 pound, which we will not need here. <laughs> nope. <laughs> not over this place. So our goal right is, we have to catch one on a glide, by the way. That is a goal. Whether we catch a limit or not, doesn't matter. Yeah. We catch a nine pounder for the camera. Yeah, for the cam cam. Yeah, I wonder if that one's going to get caught today. I was thinking about that on the way up. That poor fish, man. That thing is like simple jack how many times it got caught. Pretty much. Hunter, if you're still listening, so I've caught two and I've made the least amount of casts. Just want to let you know that, boss. It's true. It's true. I absolutely love Hunter. I do. I really do. We have a weird relationship, but also he's good. Smallest baits. This is also this is also true. Every hunter, every boat hunter's been in. Ninety percent of the boats hunter's been in the last two weeks have broken. Pretty much. Geese just flew in, dropped a shit in the middle of our cove, and left. What does that mean? Is that a good sign or a bad sign? I don't know. We'll get back. We'll get back to back to that. <laughs> who's who's Johnny? I don't know who John, Johnny, who are you? He keeps talking about it. So do you have a trailer on that jig? I do. I'm gonna work all the way back up in there too. And I don't have actually a transducer. So yeah, I was gonna, gonna ask you about off. that. Yeah, because if I don't have a transducer, it, it cuts down the interference, which is funny because I have terrible interference. Uh, I'm throwing a, a fat impact 4.8 inch Kitek white on my, on my swim jig. Ugh. 
So I, almost, I almost take one. And well, guys, we're going to be live streaming for as long as these mics have power. I didn't charge them last night because I didn't think this was going to, this was all last minute. The next time we do this, it'll be way more professional. Oh, I saw Phil Friday. At Anna? Somebody at Anna? It's the guy you fish with all day. It, it might be. Daniel, is that you? <laughs> what are you doing? Back. Oh, sorry. It is. Oh, it's got to be him. Five feet. <laughs> Why is your name Johnny? <laughs> Oh man, I was wondering. I was I thought it was some like boomer named Johnny first. Oh, you got man. one? That's that's dirt. That's dirt back there. Bum, 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 bum. Brew tank said, I crushed him yesterday. I had a matter woman. Yeah, I mean, the Potomac's going to be heating up. I'm going to start covering the Potomac more. It's honestly, it's weird. Like, a lot of people, at least from what I've heard, don't like to fish the tidal Potomac in the wintertime, so I don't cover it as much. Plus, like, you know, smallmouth fishing in the wintertime is usually really freaking good. So, and you got musky fishing too that's hot. Like, but then come like late March. April, I'm going to be, I could probably do an episode every week on the tidal Potomac. Yeah, we got four feet here still. Hmm? We got four feet here still. It's insane. Huh. Oh, ah, that's mine, but I don't care. Navy H A Navy I O H. The picture quality is pretty poor. Got one. Thomas is whooping me right now. And lost one. Yep, I didn't set the hook hard enough. I was reading. I was reading uh, Navy's comment. I apologize, guys. I just missed a really good one. Uh, and he said the picture quality sucks. And like, I'm sorry for it, dude. I am doing the best I can. I don't have ten thousand dollars worth of satellite equipment, so. Hopefully the audio is good. I thought it, I could either make a YouTube video today or I could just go live. And honestly, live is more fun for the interaction. Plus, my channel really can't do videos because it's a podcast until I get my second channel up and running. I just lost two good ones because I'm a dumbass. So I'm going to fish. Well, I am fishing, but you get my point. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's all good quality for being live on the lake. Thank you, God of Thunder. I really appreciate it. Uh, I'm new to fishing, and the, the res is the nearest lake. Still figuring out. Thank you for the value. You're very welcome, Ed. I really appreciate it. Hit that like button, guys. It really helps us out in the algorithm. Uh, maybe we'll interview. Maybe if we really suck fishing, we're just going to go pester some of the guys that are fishing the tournament. <laughs> we'll do that, too. Uh, yeah, if I could, you can buy, like, a puck, an, in, an internet puck, but it costs, like, I think it's, like, two grand. All the fish we've I've hooked has been in this grass. I noticed that. That's why I just pitched back here. So, and I mean, something else you guys can think about, like once you get a couple of bites on something, that's where I'm gonna like stop switching as much and just start locking something into my hand. And what's interesting right now, man, they are just slack lining it too. I would throw that. I would throw that. Uh, you got a Texas rig? Huh? You got a Texas rig? No. Oh, it's gonna say whatever you can cast back up in there. I'm surprised I didn't get a bite on this. I think it actually the picture quality got worse as we got farther back up in here. Uh, probably, yeah. Uh... So we will only be fishing at the boat ramp, everybody.
I almost hit your phone. Nice. <gasps> Whoops. I'm thinking we cut back down that bank too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Goon. <laughs> that was funny. That was funny as hell. Uh, I'm sorry, dude. What was your question? <laughs> Someone said, what river? Somewhere in the southeastern portion? We are in the Occoquan Reservoir. Unless he was talking about when you were talking about the Potomac earlier. I don't know. Probably. probably. Nope. Wow. Uh, Thomas is stroking them. Yeah, hit that grass. See? Whatever this stuff is. I don't think they want spinnerbait. Uh, I think they're getting pounded with spinnerbait, honestly. Everyone Probably. Every brother here, like, they're on the spinnerbait. Probably, yeah. I mean, reputable sources nice one. told me to throw one. Oh, yeah. He's already too close to the boat for gliding action. I mean, we have a chance in hell. It's probably going to be because of you and the glide. No pressure. Because I've already been like over six. Uh, what uh, what river? We're on the Aquaquan Reservoir uh, in Northern Virginia. The, uh, the tournament started at seven. We launched at seven thirty. Uh, I think the weigh-in's at four, which is easy to get to because that's just, we don't. It's this lake is a motor restricted lake. You can only have like a nine horsepower, and uh, we have a two twenty five. So. A bit over. Mm -hmm. Again, guys, we're just going to live stream until basically the mics die. Oh, what was that? A lot of activity in this freaking creek. Oh, yeah. up here man i wouldn't mind throwing a swim jig honestly it's been so long since i've done that i would also throw i don't know the glide bait yeah no i'll definitely be throwing <laughs> glide bait. if we don't want me throwing on spinning tackle i'm just giving you bad reputation <laughs> <laughs> oh man There's a nice one right there. Shit. All right, well, well, that's actually a good thing, probably. You stuck? No, uh, I think I just had one bite the tail. Uh, you know what we should have tied on is a freaking like weedless something. Oh, I do. Red rig. Ah, uh, Aquan looks like a perfect time and conditions to catch some yes. And guys, again, I apologize so much for the quality. Uh, one day I want to load, I want to figure out how to get this boat wired correctly so we can like legit do it. I think, I think this is kind of fun. Wait, are the power poles? Yeah, the poles are down. Mm, to you going to blade bait or trap off the bottom? I could. I have. I don't have as much confidence as a chatter. Chatterbait's my kryptonite, honestly. I'm not gonna lie, chatterbait is my kryptonite. I just. Don't oh, fish a lot. I just brought some. I ha oh, I have them. I didn't use them. I used to do pretty good on it. I have a ton of traps, though. And I might trap them later. There's a ton of grass, though, right there. I think we're going to have to go. We're going to have to start finding all that shore vegetation. Mm hmm. 
which honestly, I, I don't, don't know if that's going to hold the big ones. Well, we catch a limit. But is that, is that a fish right there behind your bait? Uh, that is a fish behind your bait. I don't even think that was my bait. Yeah, that's your bait. No, it's not moving. Yeah, it's been in the same spot the whole time. The hell is that? Now, my bait just went past the fish. That's my bait right there. Oh, they swim away. Oh, that is a fish. Hold on, turn back down. Find him? Yep, they're moving. They're moving. I'll let you get on it. Right. That is. We're gonna dink and dunk later, boys. Let's just, um, I'm being stupid. I'm being really stupid. I've caught, like, I've hooked three or four on a stupid, uh, what do you call it? Oh, yeah, we're yes, dink and dink. dunking in a home run contest. Did I just lose my swim? swim? Yeah, that's true, too. Where the hell did it go? It's right here. Oh, thank God. Yeah, he's my, uh, yeah, he's my special needs coach. He helps me. No, no, I'm special needs, by the way. He's keeping me, like, going places on time and keeping my pants on. That rod was actually in my hand the whole time I just gaslighted you. <laughs> I was just like, what the fuck? <laughs> today bill did have a, a big one look at his uh came in real following it real close i don't know what he didn't like but he did not like something i almost wish i was fishing a bone color in this water i got a bone not in this oh that's true Veg. It's good grass. Uh, it's good grass, very good grass. Not. I wonder though how many people are gonna be throwing a glide bait after those picks drop to where like they're not gonna be on it. Uh after what drops? Uh I think there was a person that caught a nine pounder the other day on a glide bait that was posted all over the internet. That's uh oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it's mixed buddy. Phil. Mm, no real move us. Alright, watch out. Snap them, I'll switch spots. There you go, Jimmy's. Jim Jim's. He just ate the tip. Almost knocked my mic in the water. They're right there on something. Oh, that was grass. I'll do it.
Yeah, some are in it. Not really that really big. Those Jimmy's. That's the other way. Let's get up on it. You can ask old Johnny. I hate fishing live scope behind somebody. We're gonna, so the plan is guys, I'm thinking like, we're just trying to chase, this is my issue with scope is I just don't know when to stop. And I'm thinking like right now where there's a shallow bite, we're gonna just go yep. catch them and then we'll figure it out. I mean, I mean, I, these fish will be here. You know what I mean? I don't know, like, and this is, this is a good conversation for Phil. Phil, is this glide bait bite get better or worse with sun? Generally better. Um, low pressure deal can make some really good days but uh like you can catch some really big fish on this taste but um more sun can actually be a really good thing you are guys working your face at the bottom of the uh, we don't know what we're doing yet in the middle uh, we are working middle slash upper portion of the water column generally. fish right there yeah we're gonna we're gonna probably hit we're gonna come back through here again too uh water column i'm working about seven inches of water and phil's hitting everything else big question is phil do you have another colored glide bait <laughs> yeah i got he's gonna throw the hud the big old 15 20 inch <laughs> now that is a i don't think color matter does the color matter when it gets that big that is a clear water bait right there Um, depends, honestly. It's just like everything else, color doesn't matter until it does. It's been, you know. This is, yeah.
there's a big log. Look at that log right there. Oh yeah. Jake Harshman says, tactical bass and catches more fish on their lives. This is very true. They also have way more followers. And I never said I knew how to catch them. I just know how to talk about fishing. Huge difference. I didn't even know they did lives. Uh, I think they do lives. Oh yeah, Jake said earlier that you were too good to text them back anymore, apparently. Oh, about what? Oh. I don't know. Yeah, I'll, uh, yeah, when I get off the water, I'll text you today, boss, about whatever. Oh, yeah, about doing a live stream. Jake likes to, like, ask for stuff last minute. He's kind of like you. Yeah, pretty much like me, yeah. And me. we got to catch some more of that, guys. We're gonna probably come back through. Well, we're gonna have to come back through here. We don't have to, can't go too far. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we'll hit it again with some other stuff. Maybe that guy can give us a tow. <laughs> Is that legal or illegal? I don't know. Uh, hey, bud. Uh, probably legal. Should be legal. Just pay someone to drive us around the lake. Yeah. There's some nice clumps of grass right there, though. I feel like the crazy ex-girlfriend. <laughs> hey, if the shoe fits. Yeah, what kind of bait is Phil throwing? Phil is throwing a camouflage bait in mud. Uh, camouflage bait. You'd be surprised. I've seen them pick this thing up from way, ways away. The thing about this bay is it moves a lot of water. Mm. You guys have more fish than any of the Red Crest finalists today, if that makes you feel better. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Nice. Hunter bringing in the hype. Hunter, you need to come fish this. He doesn't. He won't. He will. Oh, I think he's actually uh, working though. Because I'll ask him. No, oh, that's true. Instead of you. Yeah, I don't know. We can always get hurt by how I'm like, you know, dude, like, I'll treat you right. We should have a we should have a tournament that's highly illegal, all three of us in the same boat together. Ooh, yeah. That'd be really fun. I mean, they'd probably let it happen. There's just some reasonable, yeah. some nice guys here. You know? They'll let us, they'll let us wow, You're an eight foot. What? That can't be right. That's not right. <laughs> Definitely not right. Yeah, I'm seeing bottom here, boys. Yeah, let's let's back out of here. Overcast. Attempts in the 50s, bro. This is bladed jig time. Yeah, I know, Jake. I've I have a box if you want one. I might. Look, it's right back there. I might. I might. Bro, why are your power poles like? Hmm. Oh, I was going a little too fast. Twist. Twisty. They do that. It's like what, the third boat to hit that pocket? Yeah. <laughs> You know what's interesting though, guys, this is really a good thing about like what we've talked about on the show about people that have 500 spots and if you don't, what you should do. And you know, we have literally limited ourselves to we don't know this place and we don't have a big engine basically. So you just, you really got to hit everything. And then remember where you, like I, I have a mental image of where I caught my, where I caught two and hooked a third. And we'll go back there because it might just be a key spot for the day. 
because sometimes those key spots can change like from day to day. And if you never, if you always run new water, which there are pros to that, it's harder to remember those key areas. But if you only stick to like a small area of the lake, dude, you're, you're going to have that thing so mentally dialed to where like, okay, this is the juice right here. The hell is that? So I'm trying to figure out. I'm like somebody's on a megaphone. Somebody's in trouble. There's some, there's some fish right there. We have birds dropping there too. We got birds working boys. Birds barking? Yeah, to the left. Birds be going off, huh? Where'd you go? Like grocery shopping. Hmm? <laughs> Except you can't. You have to like fight for your groceries. Live scope. I'm just painting it around. Seeing which mark I like best. Selling my soul, swimming that swim bait. Swimming baits all day. Fishing over town mounts. Where are you going? That way. I thought, let's go left. Let's go left. Are you want to go right? I'm gonna go right. No, Cause I just, there was somebody that already went that way. I just want to check out this point right here. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, guys, should we go downstream or upstream? Right now, Phil's going upstream. Let us know in the chat. Let us know. What are we doing? Just checking some willow things. bladed spinnerbait. Uh, I do not have spinnerbaits in the boat. I took them out yesterday because I'm an idiot. Right now, I'm throwing a jig. He's throwing a glide bait. Nice one right there. Oh, where's that? 55 straight up. That's 50. I don't think so. Here, you can hop on the pedal. You're good. Get him! 
Get him, Thomas. He's coming over. That bite might be gone already. I already missed my two. I did remind me, I did bring money for the guy. The guy. Yeah. Yeah. Swim bait guy, guys, not a drug dealer. <laughs> Should not keep saying shit that makes it worse than this. <laughs> the guy. Uh, Hunter texted us, Thomas, if there was a way to add fish count and maybe an unofficial weight on the screen, that would be sick. That would be sick. Hunter, I like Hunter. Hunter, uh, SP has to win to pay for his boat, and uh, Thomas has to win because he used his rent money. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, ah. Uh, All you know, true. This is not wrong. Oh shit, there's a massive pocket over there we just missed. I'm a freaking idiot. We're going the wrong way. There's a massive pocket like right there that we could be fishing. Hmm? Which? What? This Around down there. The corner? Oh sweet, yeah, we're gonna go that way. Yeah, it's way closer. Get on it. <clears throat> All right, guys. Wait a minute. I had good luck on a chatterbait yesterday morning. Yeah, I just, again, I, I just, it's a personal preference thing. I like fishing a swim jig, generally speaking. Um, I feel like a, this is just my personal opinion. Chatterbaits are great baits, fantastic. Generally speaking, I like a swim jig more. I feel like I have more confidence in the swim jig. I can fish behind people way more comfortably with a swim jig than a chatterbait. I can... I can slow roll it, I can cast it up into stuff, and also I can just fish it on the bottom like a jig. And even with a swim bait tail, I've still caught a bunch of bass on a swim bait tail, swim bait setup on the bottom just shaking it. Way more than a chatterbait. Again though, chatterbait's a great bait. Not saying the chatterbait isn't a good bait, but there are tournaments won, John Cox, on the old swim bait. Plus a lot of people hate the swim jig. I don't know why, they just, they go straight to the chatterbait. And I'm kind of the guy that when everyone goes left, I go right, and so, you know, if the comment section says everybody catches them on a spinnerbait, chatterbait, I'm be like, okay, well, come tournament day, maybe I'll test some other things out because maybe they're shell shocked to that. And that's generally what you should do. If everyone says that a, oh boy, mark that. That's a massive tree. But uh, yeah, that's just kind of my thoughts on it. Like just to check other things. I think as anglers, people get so conditioned into just doing the same freaking thing. And it's the same thing with the chatterbait. I'll just throw the chatterbait. Granted, if the chatterbait bite is on, like yeah, it's just, it is what it is. You gotta do it. I hope somebody saw that. What? I just zinged a treble hook like three feet up in the air. <laughs> and then another thing is you guys might be saying, I'm just live scoping, that is not true. Um, it's not just live scoping. I actually have my phone resting. I have an extra phone this time 
uh, resting on the graph with the chat up so I can see it. That's why I keep looking down. And honestly, I'm going to blame you guys because that's why I missed one fish is I was trying to read a message about the service sucking. Where's those split ring flyers at? Yeah, it's in one of my boxes. Oh. oh, dear. It's in the back, I think. Is there a big box in here? Uh, yeah, it's in the back. All right. Or is it behind you? Yeah, it's behind you. Or in front of you oh, now. I see. I'm I dyslexic. See. Let's go. <laughs> You're kind of dyslexic, guys. Sorry about that. What you need, I can hand things to you. You know what? You're smarter than me. No. You are, because like that, I should have like, you know what? Damn it, he's right. I should have done that. <laughs> well, you know, you're just, you know, you just can doing your thing. You can keep your pants on. I was like, oh shit, you're right. I can, uh... Just doing the thing. I know the fish is making some noise. I have no idea if there's water in the live well, to be fair. I will check that. <laughs> I mean, it sounds like it does because like he's making noise. You know how them be. Silly fish upset with like... Oh, it's those gay... Uh, oh, it's rowers. not the rowers, are they? Yeah, them rowers. Oh, boy. I could have a lot of fun with one of them with a glide bait. <laughs> you want to check to see if the fish got water? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Please. <laughs> then we can kind of get back to... <sighs> they got water? There's uh, some water, yeah. Uh... Maybe it should be on Recirc, I forget. This is old. Oh, whoops. <clears throat> Come on. Oh, no, that's sad. Now you've done it. We're not gonna be throwing crankbaits. Cause I just lost it. I did bring square bills. Another thing that people don't throw a whole lot of anymore. Squares? Yeah. Yeah, it's a shame. Oh, what a damn shame. At least I don't hear anybody talk about it. Oh, French. Well, square bill's on. Move that there we go. Is that a fish? No, it's a tree. I just lost my bandit, damn it. I'm gonna go freaking find more of those special bandits. Unreal. I know. All right, where are we going? There's, there's a, that's a pocket. That's yeah, the start of a yeah. pocket. Back there, past there. There, we'd have to go way farther, and I'm yeah. just thinking battery wise. Yeah, yeah. This would be a really cool place to actually check out. Um, with a John boat? Yeah, with a John boat. I, honestly, though, it's like I would love to get an old fiberglass boat and then just put a 10 horse on it. Yeah, get like an 18 footer yeah, or something. Or like a gambler. I don't know. Something like that. Oh shit. Shallow. Real shallow. We're waking them up. I'm 
going to be about right about oh, there you go I guess it's about as shallow as I can get so it's not 22 feet <laughs> What happened in life, guys? Let me know in the comment section that you decided to become a coach for a paddle team, a rowboat team. Yeah. Was that your first choice in life? Were you passionate about that? Did you fail out of school? Are you a registered sex offender? Like, what makes that a thing? Don't get me uh, started on people that paddle kayaks around. <laughs> I said like that the last fishing. <laughs> the last thing I said registered sex offender. You're like, listen, don't get me started. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me started on that registry. <laughs> better just stop there. <laughs> just the, the stream just goes black. It's like, yeah, you've been... Oh, no. Your account's been suspended. I hear helicopter sounds. Yeah, you, you can't. It's like, as soon as you start talking about Epstein's Island in Ukraine, it's just like, things just got liquidated. <laughs> the hardest part is how we actually got... Oh, my... <laughs> Get you some! No, you, you take that fucking thing. You should off to the camera. We said white boys. We said white would fucking work. White boys and girls. I am so hard right now. Oh my god. Yes! We got two. Yeah. I mean, they need to get a little bit bigger, but that one is a dang good start. Woo. When it's prom night, I like to, oh gosh. When it's prom night, I like to take fat girls to the dance. Mm. Oh. oh, I'm shaking, I'm shaking. That was like a rock hit the water. Oh my god. You know what's funny? I didn't even know if this bait swam. <laughs> well, does it swim now, boys? Because I made it like in like 20 minutes one night back in the fall just to have an extra. Oh didn't my god. Test swimming or anything. Justin Marshall says, get it. Yeah, we got it, boys. Woo! That'll wake you up. Oh my god. <clears throat> So next time what we're going to do is we're going to have a GoPro and a phone going. So when I re-upload it, the quality will be like way better. But holy crap. How big do you think that fish was? Um, Look what he just came off of. That's like right next to the boat. What is that? It's a big ass log. Oh. Look at the shadow. Oh my God. I'm shaking right now. I don't know. Was... Phil just caught a 10 pounder. A <laughs> 10 pounder. Probably close to five, if not a five. Five. So we gotta catch five like that to actually have a chance. I don't know, I can't I can't really tell anymore because like You've caught so many, you're like they all well, like feel the same. Five pounders come in so many shapes and sizes, it's like Dude, getting that net, I was having a panic attack. My god. Yeah. That I, was I was about to swing them in and then you came with the net and I was like, yep. Yeah. I just wanna like also let's just talk about real quick. That was a hell of a job keeping pressure on that fish. I don't know if the, the camera saw it, but like as soon as he got in the net, the hook came out. Yep. <clears throat> you can tell he's a trained musky angler. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, oh. Those, those muskies do not. There's a big one. Look, we just spooked a big one right there too. We're going back through here, boys. They don't give you many chances. Let's go, boys. They see me tizzing, they tizzing. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oof. Again, guys, this is not part of the podcast, so I do not condone anything tomorrow that I said today. Oh, somebody was right around the corner. Uh, oh, yeah. Get get bleeped. Nah, get, I could get fucked. Get bleeped. <laughs> <clears throat> Hashtag. I don't know why now I'm censoring myself. Get bleeped. It's like an R-rated movie that just, like, really leans into the G by the end. It's like, all right, now that we've had the hardcore sex scene, let's make it sure the kids can watch this thing. Right. Now... Boys and girls, that right there is why yep. you don't give up on a cast with these things because you have no idea when one's going to shoot up. Of course, unless you're looking at live scope. 
That too. Yeah, we even caught a fish off live scoop, honestly. No. <clears throat> Which that's what people were saying. Which honestly, guys, this is the kind of like the crazy part here. Just to like with with the scope. There's, speaking of scope, actually, <laughs> right there. Oh yeah. Send that. Um, a lot of times, I just use it to make sure there's bait in the area and there's stuff swimming around, and then you can make your cast. Because like a lot of these fish, besides, well, that one was pretty shallow too. All of our fish are like sub five feet, four feet of water. Mm. You know what sucks, guys, is I did not charge the mics last night, so I know in my heart they're not going to last all day. What a mistake. That was a mistake. I did not think this through, but going next time, boys, we got this thing set. Oh, this is, I'm shaking right now. I'm shaking. We only got two, and because this place has a weird ass, like you need like 15 and a half on a new moon on a Friday. <laughs> it's actually a six fish limit here for some reason, so... But I feel like if we come in with five, but they're all six pounds, we'll, we'll be good. I don't know who that is. Is that, is that Mc... No, that's not McRib. McNugget. Yeah, you think you wanted that thing or what? Oh my God, dude. <laughs> just destroyed that thing. That was wild. A backhanded pimp slap next to the boat. Watch out. Dude, it's just like a rock. I thought like a rod fell in the water and you just see the tail. Yeah. Dude, guys, that fish was so big at first, I really thought it looked like a musky or a pike or something that came up and smoked it. That's why I have more confidence in these bigger ones than like the six and the seven. Really? Honestly. Because it's got more draw and... They just, I don't know. It's just something about it, honestly. It just gets the right ones once you have the confidence in it. Dude, that was freaking, that was awesome. That made the whole trip. I like how hunters, like, like we're going to have more people watching right now than on uh, MLF. Yeah. It'd be hilarious. I just want to see, I want to see McNugget or SB actually comment on something. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'll just drop it right on one's head. There's actually grass right on that point. That's what's sick about fishing this dirty water too, because like if we were on Anna, you would have not gotten that boat side eat like that. Mm -mm. No way, sir. It shows you how much like just a color change, man. It's like, yeah. I, I really do stress that to the younger people watching. If you're throwing a, a, a swim bait or whatever, and you're like, oh, they're not hitting black and blue, like change the color first, because it might just have been the colors been a problem. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. And it's not just the pre-workout and the amphetamines, guys, I'm shaking. <laughs> <laughs> Max. I did get bit right to the right of that log. You might want to send her right in there. You see that green shit? Yeah. Like, take it to the right. The greenery. Yeah. <clears throat> Good one? Yep. That might be a keeper. It's a buck. Let's go. Dude, this is sick. My man. Fishing the boat. Thomas is running the uh, recovery drill on a <laughs> one pounder. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I'm fired up. Oh my god. I think they gotta be like 16 inches here. So I brought my kayak board, even though uh, I don't own a kayak anymore. Yeah, so what is the slot here? Uh, I think it's 15. I think. I have no, actually, I have no idea. Let me check that. It's 15 inches, but I thought it was 16. Is 
State law requires that no more than five, okay, 14 inches, okay. All right, here we go. Sounded like you were getting you got into three. south car compression there for a second. Where's Donkey? Okay, you're gonna get a yellow tab. Because I just know if we have any hope in hell of winning, you gotta go. But I can limit us and then he can just win it. <laughs> Hunter, if you're listening, I still have not caught one on a Ned rig. I will make sure that happens. Yeah, look, that's on the list. <clears throat> so the first time I threw it in there, I got slapped. And then this time I just kind of just slow, I just like put my rod to like that and just let it just go down the drop uh -huh. and he just clunked it. I think that fish was like right by the boat, honestly. I think he was too. Yeah, I think those bucks are up shallower. I don't think the bigger ones. Oh, are. and this is a, uh, you threw yourself on a grenade, God of Thunder. I did. I just like, and my knees aren't hurting or, or like kind of messing up. I should get a sponsor for like AARP or like some kind of like joint supplement. Hold on, give me a second here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cast in. But dude, yeah, God of Thunder. Like I was like, I already missed one. I'm not going to miss two. Yeah, the bucks are up, but then again, it's like, do you like, and this is a good thing, just asking the chat what your thoughts are. That's just from a strategy standpoint, should I throw a big glide bait or should I just keep doing what I'm doing? Like I'm getting bites, so maybe I feel a limit. No, you, you keep doing you know? what you're doing, just doing your thing, getting bites, because we can learn stuff from that too. That's true. And we promise next time. So apparently, allegedly, I'll say it on last year, I don't care. We're allowed to drink. And do other things next time phil and i are in the boat we will be have our sponsor uh wait what was our alcohol sponsor uh my, my sponsor is coors light okay coors light we're gonna have coors light in the boat for every like we will shotgun a beer how much water clarity do you think you have um a foot maybe three <laughs> yeah yeah like it's, a couple clarities <laughs> i don't know it's it looks like stained coffee water oh yeah that's another thing that um I didn't really touch on, you know, the swim bait craze really came out of California and everything. And so the general consensus on information was that glide bait bite means really clear water. But <laughs> as you can see here, that's not the case. No moss. If you have live scope, you know that fish can see baits, glide baits are regardless, or not see them, but feel them from much farther away than we've been led to believe. 100%. Uh, another pro tip, guys. Don't be ashamed to cut and tie. I think a lot of people... Yeah, that's one of my problems is I don't change yeah. enough. Because, like, what I'm... I'm going to just do this right now is... Hey, listen. I caught two. Aaron Martin's kind of showed... Proved this to me, like, how much he would not fish in a tournament. And you're like, what do you mean? Like, he will retie everything. He'll sit down in his boat and just his hooks. Like he, his, his viewpoint is you shouldn't need eight hours to catch five good right. ones. And so he takes the time to do those little things. And I really appreciate that. Cause I don't do any of that. The devil is in the details. Right now I'm on 18 pound. I feel like it's 18. I eh, no, 16. This is 16 pound fluorocarbon sunline. If you guys are wondering. I need to do it like Hunter and get a label maker and label my reels. Yeah. Hunter got the tism for that stuff, which is good. It does. You can have a good tism. I am jealous of that, honestly. It's early. You guys are doing good. Thank you, God of Thunder. And guys, again, please like it. Like, uh, please like this thing and share it. If you could share this in faith. This was so last minute. I promise that if you guys want Phil and I to fish again to do this, we will 100% do this again. Um, oh my God, is that a fish or is that your bait? Where? My bait's out there. What's that? That's a fish. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I don't know if you noticed too, I changed your settings a little while back. Matt? Yeah. Got another one. Alright. Real, real, real. Alright, here he comes. Here he comes. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, 
Seriously, oh. I told you. What did I tell you? Yep. I rolled out of bed this morning and I yep. had a killer instinct. Mm. Something was gonna go down today. Let's go, boys. <sighs> <sighs> Oh my gosh. Oh, I just freaking missed one. This is happening. This is happening. This is happening on live, guys. This is happening on live. <laughs> it's like Randy Howell with the classic, like, I have this overwhelming urge to turn on the camera. And I promise, guys, I'm shaking because I'm excited, not because I'm relapsing. Let's go. Oh, another one. Another one. Oh. It's prom night, and we're taking all the big girls dancing. You believe? Oh. Live wheel's getting tight, boys. Ooh. You have super glue? No. Shit. Do you have, actually, you should probably retire. Oh, you, man, you're bleeding. Phil got shot. That's that fish thumb, baby. That's how you know you're yeah. catching real ones. Yeah, let me just go ahead and put away all my other stuff for yeah. the day. Yeah, put all the way and, and retie, please. For the love of Christ, retie. Oh, actually, first, while you cut that off, show that off to the camera. This is a sponsorship plug right now. Yeah. So this is a fish everything TS10. Um, oh, about fell in the live well. Uh, <laughs> doesn't have any eyes on it or anything. I used to work with the maker Vic, making and selling these things. And then a couple weeks ago, I got out of it and moved back home. Um, but this was one I made back in the fall uh, for some fishing trips I was doing, and. So normally they have eyes and all that good stuff, but yeah, it's like a nine and three quarter bait without the tail. Um, four and a half ounces. And it gets munched. For the love of Christ, retie. Yeah, I do actually need to retie because I noticed. Pop a Gatorade. That this not slipped a little bit. Where's the pliers? Where's the pliers? I have the pliers in here. Hand me my my uh my big rod. <sighs> Keep going while we're going. Keep doing what we're doing. What's the action like? Uh Draggy free. Please tell me what do you mean? Like, what do you mean by what? What is the action like? You mean the bait? You mean I, the fishing I'm right now? Assuming he's talking about the bait. Oh yeah, that's a good call. Um, I don't know. So the action on these, it's. So I know everybody right now is talking about like choppy glide or wide glide, and I I don't really like that conversation because it doesn't. There's a lot of really good glides out there that don't necessarily fit in either category. It's kind of a mix of both. You can make it do either. Um, this one, I have it set up, and this is how I set up a lot of glides, just for the fishing that I do. Um, it's like a extra it's it's like a slow float really like if i leave it sitting there eventually it'll pop up on the surface but if i run it down and i do rod pops downwards um it'll start diving down and it'll hang down there a little bit and then sl start slowly rising back up which is key it's what you want um because more often than not, sometimes there's other instances, but more often than not, you don't want that thing sinking back down in their face past them. It turns them off. So. Yeah, on the Diddy 6. Okay. 
Huh? That's what the guy said. Yay, Diddy Six. <clears throat> I think that's English. Yeah. Or he's from Baltimore. Oh, Diddy Six. But, oh, oh, he's tight. Yeah. Yeah, so that's kind of the deal with that. So how many we got in the boat now? We got four? Yeah. Yeah, we got four keepers. We only need two more in this weird ass freaking Is it six? Yeah, it's six. You're allowed to bring seven, but you can you weigh six. Uh so I what's the point of bringing seven? <clears throat> If you have one that's like borderline. You know what? I feel like I should try to keep my tongue semi-quiet on that since we're fishing these poor people's turkey for the first time and we might win it. It'd be weird if the first time you come up here and you just start shit talking it on a live stream. But guys, yeah, please share this to your Facebook group. Please, please, please. This is very last minute. And what's funny is, uh, well not funny, but like yours, yours like definitely uh, sinks more than the one I'm throwing. And just to explain, like, why yours is, like, better, like, it, it, it's under the water. Mine's, like, waking more. Yeah. Is there a reason? Is it set up? Is it the weight? Yeah, it's just the buoyancy of the resin and how much weight's in it. What size line do you use usually? I'm using, oh, yeah, 20-pound fluorocarbon. Um, I've been really liking this Yozuri Top Knot. It's not, like super nicest line but it's stout and it doesn't fray super easily and um it lasts a good while and it's not that expensive so definitely recommend checking that stuff out <clears throat> i use that on pretty much all my fluorocarbon setups i also think this is something really interesting to talk about is like just understanding we caught one literally by the boat, and then he caught one out over a point kind yep. of thing. Yep, that so, one was off the point. <clears throat> and then we're also piecing together some other parts of the pattern here, too, where all of the bigger fish have come off, off the bank a little bit, almost like six feet off the bank, I'd say. But I've caught a couple of nice bucks that are up there. So just keep that in mind, people that are, that are listening. And my glide bait right now is going a lot shallower, probably because I have the setup wrong. So I'm not making the cast, I won't even dare make the cast Phil's doing. And that's one of the nice things about this time of year that I like is once you find those bucks, the big girls are right behind them every time. It's guaranteed to so find the bucks and then just back off. There's so much wood through here. See all the like, little scattered pieces? Yeah. Nothing around it. <clears throat> we have 25 to 30 people bouncing off on a stream that we just did last minute. And by the way, I cannot set the parental guidelines. So this does come across as adult content only. And the reason that's important is because unless people can view it, it, it basically kills its range. So the fact that we got 30 people on a last minute stream, that's, that's kind of impressive. Really shows you how bad apparently MLF is freaking doing today. Apparently. I mean, they're on <clears throat> late lake. Is that good or bad? That's bad. At least to me. I don't know. There's probably people out there that want to watch that, but I think they're just catching like two pounders off of dogs, basically. I don't know. That'd be a hunter question. Hunter, if you're in the chat, could you answer that question, please? Yeah, Hunter, give us an update on what's going on with Raycrest. And then, like always, I keep saying this, uh, we do not have fully charged mics, so this will not last till 3 p.m. This will shut down. Next time, everything will be better. Uh, I promise. Well, it's kind of like, for those people that hate live scope, this is not really a live scope. Well, there's one right there. <laughs> As I say that.
that last one he just came up and just like trucked it did no he didn't do that he just did one of these deals he just i just felt it just push just go like Ding. and i set the hook that's why like you gotta like they don't always just boom, slam it and that's something else like if like, you feel something weird set the hook because they will do that that's what's weird about like swim bait bites in general or a swim jig bite i think compared like a chatter bait because you guys are constantly winding it usually with a swim bait you want to fish it with like a little semi-taut line they push it or inhale it and the bite's not really hard right like both swim jig fish, it was just the line went slack and they're there. Yep. <clears throat> um, one thing, I'm about to switch back to the swim jig. Um, I would also say guys from like a swim jig or a swim bait thing. So a swim jig basically is kind of fish like a, sw a classical swim bait where you're just crawling it. When you feel your line go slack before you set the hook, just pull tight a little bit to see if something's there. Well, um, awesome. You want to tell them what you're doing while you're swimming it? The swim jig? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. That's a good point. That's why he's here. <laughs> Just helping out. I also like to switch on my glide baits for what it's worth. I switch to triple grips. Um, I just have confidence in triple grips. Triple grips are good. Now, some people like round bends and stuff. It's like, I don't know. I just. Round bends are good when you're getting a lot of those light bites. Uh, you tend to get, get a. A little bit more connections but if they're hitting it pretty good the uh the, there's so um, much wood right out in front of us shoot what do you call that slapping they slap no it? like when they're when they're hitting it good like the hook style not <laughs> oh, the round bend but yeah. the um regular like yeah like triple grips or whatever that can keep them pinned and that's a fun better. debate to me because it's like the thing that's about a triple grip is the idea that if you just get one hook with a triple grip, it kind of gets them pretty good, but you're going to have less fish if they're swiping. Yeah. And so that's kind of the thing. I, for me, with um, with largemouth, generally speaking, I like to go with the trips because you might get that one hook in them. Uh, that'll be a good hook. Smallies, I will go with round bins more because they thrash so much, you can usually get another hook in them. Yep. If you really want to get freaking, oops, sorry, nerdy with that stuff. <clears throat> the fact if we do well in this tournament is hilarious to me. When we're like out of bed, don't know what the hell we're doing. We're late to the ramp. I'm trying to find a place to take a dump. <laughs> People are making jokes. It's like, oh, look at your John boat. Yeah. There's one. Oh, cast right there. Cast right there. Point of the motor. Bait. Yep. Right there. <clears throat> Look, see that? Mm -hmm. I don't know how big he is. Huh? Cast again. Hit him again. Side note, you guys always ask, like, what do you think the most important technology is? It's spot lock and power poles 100%. They will be... As we're using scope, it's still the poles to be able to just stop. He might be betting. There's a, yeah, there's a bass there. I just saw him move. Look at him. My favorite part about that first catch was yelling at the rowers for sure. That was, yeah. It's not every day I get to yell at rowers. The coach was just looking back at me like, <laughs> these guys. What are they doing? Don't distract my girls. He turned, he turned. Get him, Taku.
where is my, my sissy little spinning rod? He's like right next to the boat. He's actually a nice one. Oh. Did you just get a swirl? No, did you see that? That fish was sitting right on the yeah. surface. You know, I want to tie on there's a walking bait. Oh my gosh. I thought it was a log. That was, a, oh my God. That's what that was? Are there snakeheads in here? Got one. Oh, oh my God. He broke me off. Oh my gosh. What is going on? Oh, he took my worm. What the heck? Yeah, what a cunt. Oops, sorry, guys. Took sorry. Shoot. I will watch my language. I know I'm going to get yelled at. I'm so sorry. Uh, that was really unprofessional. Are there snakeheads in here, Thomas? Yep, there are. It might have been a snakehead. <sighs> I want to watch my language. I got to watch my language. I got to be a good boy because sometimes I get excited. And when I get excited, I say stupid things. Cause I'm an idiot. So the comment section being like, you know, he just said all this stuff. I was like, I know, I'm sorry. That was my bad. I have no idea where I put the thing that I had. He's got the tism. I do have the tism. Risen him with the tism. But really, guys, I have no idea what happened to my my Nico weights. So I'm gonna take this old screw that I have in the bottom of the boat. There you go. <laughs> I'm just gonna do that. I like it. Our power poles, our power poles are down. Okay, cool. Yeah, I like it like that. Cool. All right, let's see. Where was the other thing I wanted? I had a plopper, a whopper, but it's not here. Um, it was sitting on the deck at one point. I know, it's gone. I think it's in the what? water. Oh, they float. Uh -huh. Who would have seen that? Apparently not. No, it's got to be in here somewhere. That's nah, fine. You know. I don't know if that's what you're doing right now. Anyway. I don't want to say my special line, but yeah, you know, when some, you lose most. Oh, I had a damn plug knocker this whole time. This big long stick, shit. I just lost a crankbait for no reason. <laughs> this is an awesome time to talk to you guys about getting medicated if you need it. And also uh, to just clean your boat up before you go fishing. <sighs> oh, this is awesome. Let me talk about being medicated. I had the plopper tied on the whole time. It was always there. <laughs> Hanging off the side of the boat for two hours. All right, let's let's keep her moving here. Yeah. I'm actually gonna not do this anymore. It's just stupid as hell. It is dumb. It's like, why, Thomas? Would you? Put that on. Oh, there's one. He just hit me. Hit me. Hit me. I might be pulling down again. Yep, you just hit me again. When you fish where we fish, it's not too often you get to run into a true power pole down kind of day. Yeah. Unless you're on the Potomac. Unless you're on the Potomac. I don't go up there, so. I mean, I will. Just never been. I mean, I'll also use my power poles and. Oh, 
That's a tree. The old, old tree. I don't know if these are bass or not. Cracks me up. People drive by this place to go to Lake Anna. Yeah. People want to. Oh, my battery light's blinking on my mic. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, we going to. Let me check mine. How's my... <sighs> Is it blinking? Yours. I think I think it must be. How's mine doing? Okay, mine's got a little bit more juice. Yeah, yours is like dead. Here, toss me your mic. Hold on. Just in case. Gonna hit him with that downhill approach. You got one mic right now. Right down to one. We're down to one mic, fellas. Hold on.
way I won't go that way. Unless they're more close enough. Can I get him a free hand? Do not have both hands? No way. People will be like, Oh yeah, for dude. I went to Subway yesterday with my uncle, and uh, we're in line ordering our sandwiches, and this guy walks in and he's holding like a bag with one hand and holding a teddy bear under his arm with the other hand. And he just like walks straight to the, you know, in front of us, like to the cash register or whatever. And he's just standing there. And my uncle's like, you getting something? And he's like, oh, no, I, I couldn't hear what he said. He's just, rah, 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 rah. and my uncle's like, what the hell? <laughs> and uh, finally, there was only one guy working in there. And he walks over. The dude was coming in to exchange a bunch of change for dollar bills and just cut right in front of us. <laughs> the, the guy working behind the counter just like dropped our order and gave it to him. He's like, yeah, he comes in all the time. I'm like, what the heck? Guys, you don't have to be this in the city to have crazy. Must pay to be homeless. It does. It really does. They did a freaking article on this one guy that begged in here. He makes like fifty thousand dollars a year begging. Oh gosh, I think I saw that. It's not sucking dick. Wild. I do like Daniel Potts' old thing about like seeing all the homeless people making a brigade. Yeah. Just letting them do a suicide cell. Yeah. <laughs> Let's hear what this man has to say. There's a big stump. Hear him out. Right there. Mm. Oh, yeah. Stump or do. Might want to spread those fish out, maybe, or something. I don't know. Probably. We did put 15 pounds on one side. <laughs> For, like, no reason. There is actually a damn good stump there. Do it. Because we can. Yeah, that's America. Ideally... Get a ten and uh, maybe a couple other calls and call it a day. You will be drinking in. Yeah. It's like that that Timmy Horton, the ramp pizza. Yeah. Call the director be like, hey, we've uh, we've already got a bag. I don't think anybody's gonna beat it.
That's what guys what I like about this. You got these channels that are very like professional and well done. You know, like SB. He's out there trying to put on a good video, and we whack thirty-five pounds fucking around with one mic. <laughs> <laughs> and not even the boat ramp. Oops. He, he probably did a really good intro. Like, hey guys, hi, it's Matt here again. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. <laughs> I no longer have a boat. Yeah, doing it like <laughs> he's supposed to. I'm out here and I'm dedicated and my shit's ready. I'm like, hey guys, I uh, have a fucking clue what we're doing. Um, nothing's prepared. I'm kind of retarded. <laughs> I'm retarded. I didn't charge the mic either. You can throw anything right on that freak. We don't need mics where we're going. Wait, can, you, can you hit that guy? What? Oh, that tree. Yeah. It's kind of hard because we're like right on top of the tree. There's one fish just chilling on the other side. Like, yeah, screw you. Yes, Virginia, they do eat Clyde Bates. Yes, West Virginia. Yes, Virginia. It's normally not that easy, though. <laughs> I don't think. <laughs> I don't think I've ever uh, caught two that size back to back like that. Oh, that, I, mine did too. I was like, oh, there it is. <laughs> Apparently, I probably won't need that. I think it's actually a lot more shallow over there than it looks. Yeah. Yeah, I think I can actually see my bait. Probably a tree or something right there. The engine! Sap the trolling motor off for one way. Yeah. Oh, yeah. See my bait right there? Just hit a treetop. Nice. Honor, I could not do that again. I know you probably didn't see that. You fucking right here. You good. This thing on? Oh, it's on one, that's why. Guys, we're so like on speed right now, like one doesn't feel like anything. It really doesn't. <laughs> I 
All right, get ready to trade spots with me. Come on. Today. There's a walk right there. Yeah. So I probably gotta keep it up. Probably, yeah. I was... Really having to pick up one more. Get this one nice shit with me. I barely get hit. Yeah, this this cove looks really nice. I definitely picked this curve, not just because of the going under the beach. Yeah, definitely. Car pull down. A lot of people that do paddling are either lesbian or taking the ant. You know, I've never gotten close enough to that scene to be able to give you a definitive answer, but based off of context clues, probably not a bad, uh, probably not a bad hypothesis. This fish. Yep. Them's be fish. I just want to see one smoke this one in the middle of his gut. Oh, yeah. Hello. There's literally a tree one, like, right there. Yeah. I don't even know where my sunglasses are, to be honest. I saw them this morning. That's great. So did I. I lost it this morning. I'm kind of things blacked out for a minute. Yeah, you kind of did. Yeah. You were moving too fast. I'm getting pretty excited. <laughs> Got four leaves. I say we pop back out more towards the main lake. I'm gonna say we hit this whole pocket and then we'll go from there. Right? Yeah, that'll work. Guys, I think my plan is. I think the plan is going to be. Yeah, what's our plan? I think the plan. I think the plan is this. I'm gonna throw this swim jig till we catch a limit. Once we catch a limit, I'm, I'll switch to something else, maybe bigger, to help fill out a little bit. Maybe a big mag draft or something like that. Um, I got a bait that I'll give you. Some kind of like that. I will. I would be throwing right now. I'll go ahead and check on them jimmies. This thing's blinking now, too. Oh, 
There it goes. Ugh. Oh yeah, they're flopping around because there wasn't any water in it. I said they were flopping around because there wasn't any water in it. Apparently. I don't know what's wrong with my live wheels. That's all the things that are problem with those. Uh, only one came up. Huh? Only one. How did I, I say that? <laughs> Saw a guy running down Anna yesterday with one power pole and dragging in the water. I don't know if it broke or. Those are the new ones, man. They're quiet. I have no
Testing. Can you guys hear me? I know. That should work. We got to get latch fix, Thomas. Yeah. I 100% agree. Actually, they have a mic right there, too. That works too. Works good, good, good. All right, let's get going here. All right, so recap the phone died for some reason. This is because, again, like. Phone died for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, if there's an echo, let me know. There's a big one. Oh wait, you got use your glide bike. I'm an idiot. There he is behind the boat. He's not. We'll be back there. I only eat it when you're blind cast. All right, so we got four in the boat. I don't know why he's making an echo. We only got four in the boat. Hmm. Let's try that. We need two more. It might be a little bit of an echo, but it's better than nothing right now, especially since our mics are freaking dying. So we're going to hit this cove and then we're going to probably circle back and probably hit the main point again because we actually caught two right there. Then I don't know what we're going to do. Probably be out of dead. We'll probably be out of battery life. But <laughs> we're going to turn going to be over. Oh, there's a nice one. Oh, bitch. Guys, please let me know um, if you can hear me, if the audio is good. Thank God. All right. Thank we are God. fishing right. the res tournament we are fishing on Aquan Reservoir. Reservoir. All right. I got to fix it. Great. So we do like so Can you hit the mic button? Turn that on. Hello? Hello? Clearly, Clearly there's there. exactly. on. Right there. Or is that? 
Let's see what happens when I do this. It looks like we're still there. Thank good. Whoa. Is that a tree? Holy crap. Look at that. All right, we're going to, is that, that's bait. That is a big thing of bait. Oh my god. Seventy five feet. Uh-huh. Every fish we caught is shallow. We could probably catch them deep, but we're not. We're not big Jesus. Jeez, I caught that one. Was it like 12 foot or something? Uh, was it 15 feet? Nope, yeah, I just I don't know. My gut's telling me like why we got the the like the shade to yeah. work. Is that a fish that jumped right on there? That point. Uh, you all need to find some steeper rock wall banks. Uh, this is de degenerate fishermen. Uh, you all need to find some steeper rock wall banks. Main leg heading up towards Ray's, Ray, Ryan's dam. Hit the left side. So spoilers, we don't have a big motor. We just have a trolling motor. We are pretty much stuck to fishing what we're fishing.
But Tommy's gonna be wailing on them buck boys today. Swim jig. Get us a limit and then we're gonna head hunt. Alright, ooh, this one's got quiet, poor babies. That's another thing, guys, I am against some call tech. One more, we got a limit. And then we we're gonna be we are gonna make those fish so sick of seeing freaking glide baits and stuff like that. Like all the bucks, man. I caught a nice buck to begin the day with, but uh it's so gonna be okay. Where's your bait? I don't disagree with you, but we do need a limit. And what I'm catching, the problem is my pounds are getting smaller. Well, all the fish I've caught have gotten smaller. The first one was the biggest I caught. I think, yeah. I think on average it takes, guys, and let me know in the comment section down below, did it usually take like 38 pounds or 40 pounds to win a six fish tournament here? SB, if you're watching instead of fishing, because you should be honestly watching me and Phil. <laughs> Not me, but just Phil. Disagree with that. Really don't, know. don't think anybody's throwing what I'm throwing. Uh, 23 to 33 pounds for the first four tournaments out there. 23 to 30, that's a hell of a range. We're, we're getting close to 20 yeah. for six fish. Yeah. Right now, we got about, uh, we got a four pounder and a definitely a five. And a three. First five was probably two and a half. And then you have to fully five. Yeah. What work? That's my boat, you know. Be. Check, check around in there, boy.
you see him now. phone keeps saying it's fucking driving. It's only in driving mode. Yeah, I don't know. It's real sensitive like that. Zero, two, two, three, four, five. One, three, four, One, five, three, five, four, five. Perfect. There's me. There's like no more vegetation either. Dangerous fisherman, uh, Dangerous fisherman. get out of that cove. You're in cove. and head left on the main lake. Fish all the rock walls and lay downs up until you get to the old dam easily. A 30 pound bag. Dangerous fisherman, I don't know if we can even get there. We only have a trolling motor. We can get there, but the tournament might be over. If you haven't noticed, Dangerous fisherman, we're fishing out of a, well, it's not a John boat. Sorry for the echo. I am planning if I ever get out of financial debt to get a newer phone. That stretch is all in sight of the launch. Where the hell are you talking about? What bluff wall? This is talking about around the corner. That way or that Up way? River. Up river. Oh shit, I mean, I guess we could try that next. I'll take a nap. All the food we brought. We didn't bring any food. I brought food. Oh fuck, remember. He brought food. I did bring one bottle of water. I have not eaten today, by the way, everyone. But I've had pre-workout, which is probably why my stomach feels like it's bleeding. <laughs> Amphetamine company, please sponsor me. Legally. Mm. I'm gonna hit these trees real quick with, the, with that one boogie. That the only that fish on the side.
This is good though. We might get one day tech back up in here, you know. Maybe. What do you say? So Domino's will deliver to the launch. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Oh, the camera view switched to your... Oh, shit. One, three, four, five, five, five. <laughs> Did they, Did vote, they this vote this one as a banner in, in, in the club tournament? I mean, I mean well, well, Mac, Mac and SB were still here, so I'm assuming no. Funny they just we show up late and they just walk away. Split screen going on. Yeah, because yeah, I'm see if that'll keep it from like locking up on us. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, we're doing it for. I think, I think we're moving fast. too fast. But it didn't do it when we were running full speed across the channel, you know. I have no fucking clue. I'm not a tech wizard. I barely, I barely function as an adult. <laughs> I'm kind of shocked we didn't pick one back here, but I guess you're right. It's got to be more mainly stuff. Uh, so, no, they did not ban uh, tournaments. Some sonar tournaments. Clearly, they didn't ban the tournament because we're here. Fish? Yeah, 
guys. Yeah, it guys, it cost three, three grand, grand for the antenna. So maybe if I, uh, if I actually do some, do some things, things against God, God we can get them. Like crowdfunding. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, that. <laughs> the Christian The Christian alternative. alternative. Suck Sucking dick. I mean, you're taking a sacrament, I guess, either way. Still got to sacrifice some dignity. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> uh. How does one rich person get the right to put a dock on here? It's funny that I did have one nice buck. It's probably about two and a half pounds. I fucking in the nest in that back cove. Yeah. Which probably, yeah. should we just do that to double back, hit that cove, and then maybe go to hit that wall? Yeah, I'd be interested to see how it looks now versus when we were in there before. Okay. These boats are so cute how they're just pushing water like a fat person trying to swim. I know. Heard they're, they're supposed, supposed to take a vote, vote on that today. today. I don't, we were late uh, getting, because of me. We were late with everything. I just kind of showed up into the boat and they already started launching. I had been here. I'd be interested if you banned Sonar just from the simple fact of like, I wonder how many people that lay lose. We want to like, by the way, we want to like, we want to like, by the way, we want to get more members, but then we're going to like start, like, it's illegal to have a boat or fish glide baits or live. And then we're like, I don't know why. Yeah. 17 fish limit. Got to do it all hand line with a Coke can. Nightcrawler, like I intended. Uh, yeah, I have somebody in the comment section being like, Yeah, I have somebody in the comment section being like, like, Yeah, you guys just need to go up like, fucker, I'm sticking my head down to read your goddamn comments. Shut up. I have the phone in front of me on one of my I have graphs. the phone in front of me on one of my graphs laid there like a professional, yeah. just so we could read the questions. Yeah. You should have joined us earlier. We you should have joined us earlier. We had a great glide bait fight. Probably want to ban those too. That's a bag that we almost had. Back, we, we did have an alleged 19 pounder break. break we had a 19 pounder break. break alleged. Off here. There's a lot of bait in here. A lot of bait in here. Again. That's so weird. It's timing out, which is awkward. I don't know why he's doing that. Yeah. Let me fuck with it a little bit.
was a terrible view for the live stream of people. <laughs> Just staring down at them with a spinning rod in your hand. Oh, I got it. I'm accepting you. POV regarding graph. I got it. You're back. How do I flip the camera, though? Oh, uh. It's facing towards me. <laughs> this is all wrong. <laughs> <laughs> setting camera scroll down front let's do dual wide <clears throat> huh uh, that's Matt. More people watching. Oh, yeah, it's funny. Oh, so, oh, I can't. It's just funny. It's funny. He's just like this professional guy. I feel like I'm Caddyshack. We're catching one. Yeah, drink. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Prepare my boat and stuff. Like, fuck that shit. Let me see them titties. Ugh. I know. I'm going to. We're going to figure out that my sub count just dropped like a thousand. <laughs> When some lose most. <sighs> Getting a look shaky fooky rig on there, whatever it's called. No, he's got a jersey on. I think Matt has a jersey. Oh, really? I don't know. Okay. Oh, camo. Huh? I thought it was camo. No, I don't know. What does it look like? I can't. Yell at him something that he would definitely react to. Huh? Yell something to that person oh. that Matt would definitely react to when we get around the corner. I don't know if that would be kosher. <laughs> Guys, we're professional. I'm professional. That is Matt. We're the only boat out here that you can tell who it is. <laughs> Immediately. Regardless that live, you know. Who's that sad person? I'm like, I don't know. I, that, that made me a little mad. I'm not mad. It's like, yeah, the like, so coverage sucks. Like, what do you think we are? Like, CNN or something? Like, <laughs> I'm lucky I put underwear on in the morning, let alone make this thing run smooth. <laughs> uh, we got my co angler. We got. Degenerate fisherman, my co-angler and I caught 33.5 pounds without scope on swims four years ago. Uh, we caught all of ours uh, without scope, believe it or not. Doing glide, doing God's work with a glide. There's so much bait right through here. Nah, uh, you sure? Bait in here, though, that's for sure. That's pretty cool. 
because I don't have food or drink. I'm gonna keep going, guys, until literally I just fall into the fucking water. I am so terrified of destroying my channel with this video. <laughs> I know, which is great is this is not being monetized, and also this will be taken down immediately and re-edited for uh, posterior sake. <laughs> Video? Oh, I will. I'm going to watch through it though and try to mute some things. <laughs> some words that stick out in my mind that are probably not kosher for kids. Oh, <laughs> uh, no, that's fine. If they're big boys enough to post it, they're big boys enough to take it. There are some game awards I feel like, you know what, in the moment I could might get away with it, but uh, yeah. Dude, there's so much crap in the water here. So when you get a chance, look at this tree. It's insane. It's insane. Like growing, like growing up, up like 15, 15 feet of water. Look at that break right there. Is that, that a fish on that break? Maybe he just ran over. Maybe. Maybe. Ran over. Maybe. 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 We'll scope if we have to, but I think we'll these fish are pretty, pretty much shallow. I think the keepers shallow. are shallow. <laughs> they could be wrong. Watch uh, Max, Max channel, SB channel. They're catching catch them in 50 feet of water. This was the tournament we should have brought in Phil's perfect rig. Perfect rig. Could have. Could have. Four tracks. Yeah. Four tracks. Yeah. All day. Yeah. So did you end up driving through front row or did you? Yeah, I went through fifty. I went the front uh, row down. Okay. Yeah, that makes more sense. Because the other way is like it wanted me to go down through DC, and I'm terrified because I don't know that way. Like, like if, if I, I miss an exit because there's so many so freaking so roundabouts and like spins and shit. You know what I mean? Right. And it's like, well, this way is like 20 minutes shorter. It's like, but this way I will not get lost. Right. So. That's your bait right there. Oh, that's mine. Is there any traps around this boat? Like, no traps I don't know. What's something we could say to him? I don't know. You talked to him more than I have. Oh, I'm, well, I didn't know which, which mount we're talking about. No. Oh. Mick Cheeseburger. No. Oh. McCheeseburger. You can say the hard R. Oh, I don't know. Chicken sandwich? We just ran their boat, being like, I'm sorry, I thought you were someone else. We just ran. There's one right there. Oh, hello. Sorry, I thought you were someone else. Oh, hello. Hello. Line her up. Yeah, it's only 48 feet away. Yeah, it's only 48 feet away. I don't think that's a map. Here's a map.
Oh my god, did you see my line jump? No. He slack on me. Would you both go down? Stop acting like you got down syndrome power poles. Good lord. <laughs> It's like bringing the girl to prom, stealing your thing, but her one eye is like acting weird. Yeah. No way he buys it again. From the PC sensitive group that brought to you by, well, you're not allowed to date a Chinese man. <laughs> You can't marry that boy. You can't do that around here. Try that. Let's try that. <laughs> it's basically like looking at a garment. <laughs> you were a garment. You were a Oh fuck! All right, actually, yeah, you're gonna have to. Take, I have got to take a piss. I've been holding a piss in for about six hours. I did not yeah. pee this morning when I took a dump. That's impressive. You know when that guy was said nice oh, bibs, Thomas? I think he was being Thomas, mean. Probably, probably. And just now I connected like, ah, oh, that's right, he's being a sweet man. By the way, guys, uh, please go watch the live stream the way, from guys, uh, Monday Night Live last Monday because uh, it was it was a rowdy Monday one. We had the whole group together. Um, we destroyed that bathroom. That was the biggest takeaway I really had from that tournament. That was the biggest takeaway I really had from that tournament. Yeah, yeah. It really did. Whole house. Like, whole <laughs> smell. House. The smell, boys. The smell. smell. Phil. The smell, boys. The smell. Bang that Phil. glide into bang some lay down, brother. Into oh, some lay down, brother. Doing, yeah, I'm, guys. I'm. I know you probably don't yeah, like I'm, this guys, uh, weird I POV I have right now. No, it didn't. Let me see if I can actually get rid of my screen. What it does. No. Uh, nope. Yours just did. Cut off again. No, it did. Let's Let's check it again. I will be getting a new phone here once I get out of financial debt. I will be getting a new phone here once I get out of financial debt. I want to get a new iPhone, but after dealing with Phil's today, I don't want to know. get a new iPhone, but after dealing with Phil's today, I don't know. Oh, okay, you're back now. What'd you do? Nothing. You sure? Yeah. Having connectivity trouble.
allow. Enter. Well, now my phone won't connect. Enter guest. Oh, I gotta add you. Uh, remove? No, you're there. You do have a comment for you on there, I think. Uh, wait, do we have an answer on it? Phil, gotta go. Yeah, why don't, yeah, we do. 100%. Michelle, Michelle. I'm actually impressed with all you guys um, for watching with how bad it, like, we had great service up until after we caught our whatever fish, fifth, 15th. So nice to see these people with these motors at this point. Yeah. yeah, it was weird moments like when we were at Smith and like we catch two back to back and we're like, it's going to be a banging day. And after that one, I thought like, guys, we're going in at one, we're getting pizzas, Yeah. it's over. And then it's like, <laughs> yeah, it happens a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, yeah, absolutely, guys. Yeah, please put us more comments in the comment section. Keep us. Uh... And then refresh your screens and let us know how it is. Sorry. This is a, another swim bait tip, guys. A swim bait and swim jig, well, both. They're honestly the same thing, how you work them, I think, like a soft swim bait. Um, if they smack it hard, like they hit it really hard, that means they're not hitting it hard. If it feels like if they just slack line you, that's them hitting it hard. Because when they hit it hard, they literally just vacuum the thing up and swallow it, almost like a jig bite. When they feel like they're smacking the hell, when they hit it, quote unquote, really hard, they're smacking at it, but they're not actually taking it in. It's actually not crankbait weather. Oh, look at that thing. It looks so good in the water. I can't believe that one hit by the boat, dude. Oh, my God. That was so sick. That was so sick. It's funny. Go, guys, watch it back on the rerun, but it's like, it wasn't the biggest one, I think, but good Lord. I think, he, I think he, his stock price just went up in the company, honestly. A little bit. <laughs> I'm going to cross this flat a little bit. I'm gonna have to be switching off the swim bait. Swim jig, swim bait, I don't know. It's like it's basically the same thing, honestly. One's got a weed guard, the other one doesn't. What they're starting to do now, I think when the sun came out, guys, they're not like they're not taking it, they're hitting the tail. Which means they probably should switch to a crankbait. That's my little thing is like if you're fishing a swim bait or a swim jig or a chatter bait and they start hooking it. It could be a color change, 100%, but it could also be like you need treble hooks. And I would throw treble hooks around here. The problem I have with uh, lipless right now is I will be breaking, basically snagging one every five minutes with all the wood. You know, we got live scope McGee over here.
I have no super glue. Boat was not ready. Might be giving uh, a friend of mine my boat since I think he blew out his engine because he let somebody drive his boat. <laughs> Forget his name though. I don't know if those are the words you use, but yeah. There's my big dog. There's my big dog. All right, guys, we're gonna try a different color real quick. I'm gonna keep it a big size, but I just wanna try a different color. Yeah, I'm throwing, I'm switching it up to a, uh, my special secret color. It's not really a secret, you can buy it. Uh, <clears throat> swim jig color, but I'm putting a uh, six inch swim bait on the back of it. You all need to go the other way up lake. We are going up lake. I think. I have no idea, honestly. Isn't this up lake? I thought so. I think we're going up lake. And that's where pretty much everybody went, so. Mm. nice though is we only need one more for to, for a limit right now because it's a six fish limit and so really you just swing one time and we're going to be golden Pretty much. Uh, i would like to get that dink out of the boat with another bigger male Yeah, I messed up, guys. Your boat is heading down like, okay, this is the way everyone went. But we're going to a cove that's a little bit closer because, again, we just have the trolling motor. We're fishing Japanese style. Literally just almost set the hook into a goddamn log. Good lord. I like. <laughs> Was that a fish? Potentially. Yeah. Pull is down. 
Tell it, bud. Slow us down like let you get your cast in. Again, you got all those fancy bows. They can move, man, but they can't do that. Can't do that shit. No, sir. I'm thinking like every cast and then just pull up and we can I'm going down this thing. Yeah. Unless you think you can work that I mean, I don't know. I'm thinking. <clears throat> just to make sure you get your good cast and Just pushed it. I wonder if the bait's too long. the fish Open the power the holes up. Let's move a little bit.
<clears throat> Not feeling good about this. I do want to hit this pocket again. And then we'll figure out what to do from there. Yeah. Now I talk like, guys, I talk like we have options. <laughs> we really don't. Uh, we're just going to take a short little boat ride. Chat, where do you think we should fish? Please help us out. Chat's already told us. That's true, they did tell us. Chat, tell us again because I have short term memory recall problems. like the first time in history that that's happened. Now that, they might outlaw in tournaments. I mean, I don't know about four facing zone, yeah. I would like, yeah. It's like Dora the Explorer, can you point to where we should cast? Good. Which one's the big bass? Is it that one? Is it that boat's so cute. I think it is. I think I'll get the needles put away. Oh, he's the guy I almost hit with my truck. I mean, he's the guy I almost hit with my truck. Oh my god. 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 Oh, Jesus. Nipped it again. We might be. The only laydowns and rock walls that y'all can get are behind you up lake. I guess we could try. You could look at my phone, actually. We'll do that. We'll definitely do. I want to hit this pocket, and then we can go hit those walls. I don't care. Yeah. Behind us. Yeah. Shit. All right. Oh, well. <laughs> I mean, it's eleven o'clock, so it takes a two-hour ride. Mother, no, nope, I just. I know. No, let's try it. Why not? We're gonna hit this pocket, guys, and we're gonna make that move. Thank you for the super chat. If your plan actually helps us catch a fish, you will win a gift card to Phil's tackle box. <laughs> Don't tell him that part. Then I can't really give away a big old prize. I, I, okay, yeah, we get where we're about is hot, yeah. Now I feel like a blonde, honestly, the, the chat telling me, like, you gotta start, turn the key. Hey, hey. You're going the wrong way. Oh, we get it now. Hey. You're fucking up. Yeah, it's honestly, now that we got a semi bag, it's that, oh, we got a new comment. Uh, that cove you're coming up on, on the left side is going to, the left side is going in. That cove you're coming in. Yeah, we're going back in there. Yeah, this cove we already caught a couple into. Uh, degenerate fishermen. Yeah, we we already got five for about twenty pounds. You think? Eighteen. No More than fifteen. Yeah, I would say so. <laughs> Give a number for the audience. It's thirty-six. I don't believe in numbers. I just believe in big fish. This is facts. Numbers are 
construct. Just our shitty interpretation of the universe. That's what I have to say about that. This has been real talk. That's, that's a, why I didn't go to college. That's a nice one right there. Whatever that is. Oh, that's a stick. Too busy fishing fly baits. Yeah, and now look at where you are. I could have fished fly baits in college. This, I, I will announce anything. Look at me now. Oh, you did? Yeah. On the water? He ran into a cove. We were in, he was running a guide trip. Stayed, he scoped around for like two minutes and left. Never saw him again. That dude, pro that dude is dangerous as shit on that place. I would not want to face him. But I don't think he was fishing the tournament on Saturday. I saw on Instagram, like, that same day he was on a flight. Like, Jesus. He, like, did a guide trip and then flew to Vegas or something. That's freaking awesome. I've always, I want to go to Vegas. I heard it's overrated. I hear it's not good if you have a gambling problem, so I think SB's yeah. got to stay away. That's definitely. I think he's there. No, really? I would assume so. <laughs> oh, did it cut off again? Hmm. He's awesome. Did you fish with him? Uh, no, I have not. I need to uh, join. No. Oh. Yeah, your camera did lock. Son of a. We're going, going back, back to Garmin View. It's even funnier because you're camera quality <laughs> so bad it's so bad dude <laughs> oh look it's back oh, yeah.
It does. Uh, let's see. We have a comment right there. I want you to read that comment out. It's a very nice comment. <laughs> Left side bank. Don't waste time fishing low percentage waters. Well, what's the definition of low percentage? Saying this bank sucks. Uh, I know. Well, no, we caught one off this. The bank right here. Your fish is doing well. Remember. I don't know, man, but I got to pee. Yeah, I understand what you're saying about the low percentage banks. Um, my only caveat to that is, I don't know if we're the first person's in here. And so clearly, if I was fishing against you, I know you would hit that bank and leave this one completely alone. So there might still be just like one or two fish on this thing. So there might still be just like one or two fish on this thing. You looking for biggins or peanuts? Ah, uh, well, you looking for biggins or peanuts? Uh, my co-angler who's uh, got his, um, my co-angler who's uh, got his black snake out right now. He's a uh, He's, he's, he's throwing a 15 inch swim bait, so uh, he's throwing a 15 inch swim bait, so uh, 18 inch, sorry. It's a HUD trout sorry. mimicker. It's a HUD trout mimicker. Mm. Plus, this is the stuff I like right here. Plus, this is the stuff I like right here. Got my puddle thin out. I've actually always wanted to fish those. Yeah, I just like you keep always hearing about those people in Cal, and I like always wanted to get on that bite to know what it's like. Yeah, yeah I just like you keep Cali. Always hearing about those people. It's Cal. Cut out again. Oh, damn it. I'll be dang. Right, I'll do that. Let the professional fish. I see, I, I, I'm terrible. I don't even remember my social security number. That's the problem. Probably should do it. No, I'll go do it.
right there. Right there. Oh, it's at that bluff wall. All right, but boom. Oh, I can't. Oh, here's the camera. You got ten people watching, apparently. I don't know how. Incredible. I can't believe we have like so many of you watching. God, I can't believe we have like so many of you watching still on this freaking. <laughs> It was so good for Ohio. It's really, I think it's because like too many people started using that phone today. I blame democracy. Yes. Yes. Democracy. Democracy. For the people. For the people. By the people. By the people. Of the people. Of the people. But the people. But the people. Are retarded. Are retarded. Look at all them there. Those are dogs, isn't those are the opposite of what I was saying. Those are, no. Those are deer with teeth and ambition. Vision. Vision. Uh, have you seen that video? That like video? cult leader guru dude. Cult leader. That was a gay one. Is that what we talked about? Uh, 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 like a oh, is he the one that used to like? Uh, have a compound in like the United States. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I watched a, a documentary on him. Yeah. He's awesome. Of the people. He uh, he took over a town in Montana, and made it to where like swinging was legal, nudism was legal, everything. They put up all the citizens and residents put up with that until he outlawed it. And then they press federal charges. It's like, how long they gonna got him? It's like, you know what? I didn't mind seeing all the naked people and a little, little weird seeing people just, you know, sexual do, things. Oh, yeah, we are alive. Doing uh, sexual there. things <laughs> out there. But damn it, you take away my bacon. It's it's a hard line. It's America. That's, that's a hard line to draw. Oh, come on now. This is basic stuff. Really regret missing that. Yep. Yep. Stick, stick. Look, sets are free. Here's the thing, like, are they off the glide or is this we're running, running the same one? Well, you know what I mean? We're, we're out of the morning window. Window. morning window now. So, so uh, you SP catch them on wood like all the fucking time. Yeah, yeah. We just gotta, we just get, gotta around get around some wood. Some wood. All right, well, pop a Viagra because we're going to be moving. Okay. Ooh. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. You like to
Uh, uh, degenerate fisherman, get out of that cove and get to main lake laydowns. Uh, we'll do. Yeah. We're gonna have him uh, adjust his camera. Right now, you guys are gonna be dealing with uh, POV for a minute. Why is the degenerate fishing fishing the tournament? Degenerate fisherman, why aren't you fishing the tournament? That's a very good question. That's why it feels here. Why are you not taking my money? It's so funny because everyone likes this bank right here, but um, we haven't caught a single one off this bank. We're going to be getting a new angle, camera angle here soon. Just bear with us and just stare at my nostrils. I would turn that off immediately. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I'd be like, seriously? Ruined my whole Sunday. <laughs> I wasn't religious before. Got family coming over this afternoon. Otherwise, I would have. I may sneak out to weigh in. Awesome. Yeah, come see us. Yeah, come. Like well, and subscribe. That'd if be I still, sick. If I still have a channel after this. How cool would that be? <laughs> Meet one of our. Especially if we caught some fish off of these tips. <laughs> like, yeah, here's the fish <laughs> in the flesh. <laughs>
not gonna lie to you guys, I'm still shocked that generally speaking it's worked as well as it has. Uh, uh there's a few boats. There was more than I can think of. Hopefully that Hopefully helps. Hopefully that helps. <laughs> There's a lot of boats. <laughs> nice. That's okay, guys. Come on, come on. Much appreciated. You're welcome. Sometimes you just need a pick me up. Sometimes you just need a helping hand. <sighs> now I'm trying to decide. Oh, we're gonna go up like I mean, we're gonna go eyes up. on lay downs or jig. You keep fishing the glide because you you're the glide bait guy. Glide because you're the glide bait guy. Yeah. yeah. Lower this crank down. You, what, what, what was that? What was that great line you told me about dancing with a girl? that got you there or something. At this point, if we want to cash At a check, we point, literally we do need one more check, five pounder. We literally do need one more five pounder. More than likely. More than likely. Uh, so we're gonna ride or die. I think. So I think we both fish a glide. I think, I think we both fish a glide. I think you should crawl your jig down oh, those laydowns. Okay. Okay. Isn't that fun when he says like, or oh, you can throw oh, the sleeper oh, crawl. crawl? He wants to try he to glide, but isn't that adorable? Oh, it's spin attack. Listen, son. Just leave all that gliding to me. Or you can throw this. These were good. Yeah, let's try that. All right. We'll have time to tie if we're going to go make this. I keep saying run and I feel so ashamed when I say it, but yeah. Right? Literally like staring at the spot. Dang it. Oh, you done it now. If you get a tiny kalash, do if work you get boys. a tiny, tiny kalash, do work, boys. What is kalash? Like a gun? It's just Where's clash. Like a What's gun? Um, this one, mate. Oh. What's up? Well, Phil's eating right now. I mean, we honestly, we do have a pretty good. Phil's like, eating right now. I mean, we honestly. I say good, but it's like, I, for, good, I guess for here, for our first time here. For our first time here. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> There's nothing there. Anyway, nothing where there. am I going? Where am I going? I don't know. You enjoy how your camera you blacked out the minute, minute I hit that thing. Did it? Yeah. Yeah. Dang it. You know what would have made us even more obnoxious? But I almost wore my chicken onesie today. <laughs> it's like Fortnite with fishing. Bright yellow.
The only problem is if we did fire the big motor up, everybody would hear us. I feel like, hmm. There's no hiding it. Guys, let us know in the comment section. Should we fire up the big engine? This will be, be our Guys, last tournament. Guys, let us know in the comment section. Should we fire up the big engine? This will be, be our last tournament. I've been chewing right beside the microphone the whole time. <laughs> it's probably why everyone just started to leave. Did everybody start leaving? <laughs> yeah, it's like we had like 15 and it like dropped to 12. I was like, what the hell? <laughs> Oops. It's like you crunch, crunch, crunch. It, no, it was sloppier than that. All right, Thomas, let's get out of this cove. It's giving me aid. Mm hmm. I feel like it's a dumb decision. So I don't do it. Let's get talk. Can not find that tree. Can not find that tree.
What's the plan? What's the plan? That away. That away. Let's get boogie. boogie. Yeah. I'm just about to tell you to turn live scope off because we're scared if you don't we might not even get there. Where are we going? Where are we going? Just that, that bluff wall right, right there, there, that bank, that point. Yeah. Here. Here. Why don't you get down with that? Get up on here. I want to make a switch on some baits. All right. Yeah, I do think. I I don't know. My gut tells me we got a decent thing. Let's just lock in for one more. We're just set ahead. North. I hit north. All right, boss, we right, are going boss. up north. Good Lord. Needy bitch. Don't you want to hear me breathe through both nostrils? <laughs> Better than us, probably. I mean, it would be fair. Even if we have a chance to do well at that point, I'd be like, all right. Yeah, yeah 100%. That's what I always do. I, I think we got we got a small one and we don't have a limit. Those are easily solved. Yeah. Well, okay. I shouldn't say easily, but it's a heck of a lot easier than having one fish at twelve o'clock. Oh god, yeah. hundred <laughs> percent. It's so funny how always there's very few times you miss a fish and it doesn't hurt you. Like that, oh my god, don't, don't, come on, man. Shoot me in the face. Where are we going? I guess it's kind of going the right way. Bobby's lost. Is it that buff wall he's talking about? I have no idea which one he's talking about. But he's got laydowns. I just, yeah. And there's, honestly, honestly, I wouldn't even be I mad either at just either. fishing up that fishing stretch of bank yeah. as far as we can. Because if you think about it, like, we just need one. And if there's just one on that stretch, it doesn't be the best stretch. And I'm sorry, I'm sorry. like what he said, like, I do think there's something to be as like, oh, this side of the bank sucks. Well, yeah, but if you and 50 other people say that, it means it's not getting any pressure. Because again, we didn't catch a single one going off the, the good side. No. Well, how we caught our two best fish is literally, <laughs> literally, literally, <laughs> 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 I don't know. 
I feel like this is a drop shot shaky head place too. I feel like a shaky head if you look here. Facts. I will throw a big old. I hope that keeps going in the right direction. It's not. It's like you bitches. Stop throwing this, this the game little stuff next to him. Legit stuff. Tommy needs to throw him a flipping jig. Need a trailer? I'm yeah. don't need a trailer either. All those jigs being tackled. I'll say that, like, that's not bad. Pretty chunky boy. I love that. Yeah, and I don't gag, which is not good. Get your mind out of the gutter, Steve. It isn't going that far back. <laughs> <laughs> that is not good. <laughs> You're sucking on the I need to feel something sometimes. <laughs> Again, I got to, I got to that conversation yeah. to like uh, yeah. SB being like, I got a bite. Here you go, guys. All right, this is a good Christian program here, wholesome for the whole family. So cut back like to. You just keep talking shit on SB. I'm not. I know you're not. I know. Just, some people in the chat are like, nothing. I'm just making a deep throating a secret joke. Let me lit. And he walks up here and he's like so professional. We are not. I'm not. But then tune in tomorrow. <laughs> I will pretend today never happened. Yeah, then you go full podcast. It's like, it's like NPR, NPR radio. radio. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk about uh, water levels on the Shenandoah statistically for the last twenty five years. And here is the scientist to tell me about that. Yeah. Um, actually. <laughs> This is actually what it's been doing. I bet right now we probably are getting more views because they're just listening to this. <laughs> oh my god. He's probably telling us, no, the other up lake. <laughs> this is up lake now. Right there, right there. Stuff. You want to just go straight this way or go this way? I was saying, let's fish this to the right here. I'll see what happens.
Garmin view again. Oh, he said go left. Okay. Well, maybe I will. This episode about what you just said, this would be the weirdest thing to upload as a podcast episode. Can you imagine just sitting in your car listening to this? I think your audio is pretty dang. What? It sounds like you're just talking through a jacket. Oh, probably because of the mic. Hello? Here, give me one of the mics. Oh, here. We don't need need to move move on on to the end. Easy. Smooth operator. Smooth. I just broke the mic. Yeah, we're retarded. It's both working so far. Huh? If we win this tournament, though, the ability of people to play back and be like, we lost to them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> just, just imagine, imagine if I would have showed up in the chicken suit, suit. <laughs> and they have to take our away in pictures. <laughs> I know somebody would get upset. <laughs> They're making a mockery of this fine institution. They're, They're making, making a mockery of us. It's like, wait, I thought this was America. Um, do we think chicken onesies are acceptable for tournament day chat? Let us know. I mean, even if it's not, like, do you really want to say it's not? It's almost like, guys, I think my live wells are broken. I think they're leaking. Guys, we're swinging. We're not going for third place. We're not going for fourth place or tenth place. We're going for one. Well, honestly, third place would pretty much be first place for us. That is true. But how so? My math ain't good. Well, because <laughs> you've got the strike strikes. That's true. And then you got the 81 boys. Chicken nuggets. And then Vic and Seth. Go left. Point the trolling motor up like go left. We just did go left. Yeah, we did go left. That was a while ago. Oh. Relax, relax. I thought I told you to throw a jig. I got that too. For one time. No one casting. And I catch an eight pounder. How much? You threw it one time. If I throw this one time and catch an eight, I swear to God, guys, the rest of the stream, if you want it, will be in my underwear. We're going to go breaking bad. Like, I am the one who knocks. I am the one who knocks. I love that. Jesse, do you want to make some meth laugh? Come on, now let's play. Jesse. Jesse, throw the glide bait. Wait, Wait his name's Jesse, right? Yeah. Just yeah. Just yeah. Oh, psych. I don't know. Second guess myself for a second. <laughs> the people are retarded. Where are all the ladies? Oh, they just disappeared. Yeah, I don't yeah, know. I don't know. <laughs> they were just there. There's supposed to be yeah, hell's lay downs yeah. down here. <laughs> Got bad intel. Got bad intel. Should we turn around? Turn around? Yeah. Go, Go left. left. See what happens. Oh, yeah, I just read that. Sorry. Sorry. 
I love watching you read the comment that you've already read like three <laughs> times. And then you get upset. Wait, Wait, you got upset? upset? What? It's the best. Mm -hmm. You're like, everybody keeps telling us to do this. I'm like, I already read it four times. It's all the same. Bill actually gets credit for working with me. Uh, it's like community <laughs> service. I get, I get a government <laughs> stipend. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that is a bass. Slow down, slow down, slow down. You have, you have one, one right underneath it. Had, had or have? Just up there. Right there. Can't, Can't see, see my bait. bait. Whatever you did, you pulled him off the bottom. Oh, I see my bait. The people are retarded. I'm gonna move my phone to TikTok Live. For as long as we have it, yeah. Yep. Look at that guy. That guy's throwing a rooster tail. That's, that's some serious power. Oh, that's got to be a bilge pump. What the heck is going on? Got problems. I do. They are not eating that is a nice glide fish, bait. Look at him. Throw a bigger glide bait.
Uh, where are we on? Hmm? Where are we on? What are, what are we on? No, where are we going? Oh. Where are we on? We're on a bank. <clears throat> so I know what drug we're on. You need not remind me. Sit. I know what we're on. Still haven't figured out how to turn off my full view. We need to keep moving up. up. Keep her moving. Do we have any more helpful comments? Um, looking at fish. Oh, snap. You actually see a fish? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Where are they? Oh, it's here. here. Well, let's see what they are. I guess they're kind of chilling behind us. Right, nice right there. Right there. I mean, they're kind of all over. They're kind of all over. Jig him. Do you guys, Do you guys have, have 30, 30 pounds, pounds yet? yet? HP. We have 20. We have five fish for 20. Probably. One 10 pounder One short. 10 pound mm. Mm. 
Do you Do have you 30, have 30 pounds, pounds HP? HP? Do you have a working mode? Well, that's just rude. Ouch. Oh, sorry, my boy. I know it's all love. Where are the bluff, bluff walls everyone talks about? We've not gone the right way. Don't worry about, about it. Just fish. fish. That's true. Well, well, also, like, where, where are we going? going? Right. Well, there is a creek that comes in. Oh. And if we go about six miles up, we actually should hit something. That's kind of cool. <laughs> Fire up the big motor. <laughs> yeah, there is a chance, guys. We could actually get to another creek today. Today. So I think we should go back into that cove. Because don't we need to be in a creek? Um, More of a thought, actually, more than a statement. <laughs> well, I guess they're both statements. I don't know. To what? The thought or like, like just keep going up? <laughs> yeah, so let's just keep going up, see what. Is that a bridge up there? Look at it. This is a moving day, boys. When's the land? Four? I think he did say four.
Well, this looks bluffy. Oh, yeah. You could tie on as a mag draft. You got like a big ass mag draft? I just got a regular size one. Oh. Six inch. Like, like a, a peasant. peasant. Like a dang peasant. I got something else though. Got a burrito, Gil. Uh, white? White. Crappy. I was gonna say. First, I was gonna say Caucasian, which would actually be a funny color. <laughs> Caucasian. I can't believe I never thought of that. A little, a little disappointed now. Guys, what would you Guys, think if there was a, a color, a shad color called Caucasian? I wonder if chat saw me rip that over the branch. Oh, we're good. Which side you want? Which side you want? Oh, we we have even have a chat anymore? Yeah, we do. Uh, uh, HP fishing, you HP said, fishing just said, let's effing, let's effing go. I guess this is where, I, guess draw this is where I draw the line on saying, saying stuff is. Oh, there they are. There are the trees. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There are the trees that we were just promised. Had just had to stay dedicated to, stay dedicated to, to the, what's, what's his name, pattern. pattern. Mm, yeah. Meanie head. Meanie head. <laughs> Insane <laughs> angler or whatever. Yeah. yeah. That's a great name. Oh, yeah, six foot of water. Oh, yeah, six foot of water. 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 Hopefully we can capitalize on the two o'clock bite. bite. Hopefully we get back, Hopefully we get back from, from the two o'clock bite. Hopefully. Hopefully. Honestly, Honestly though, though, I'd rather, I'd rather capitalize, capitalize on it. On it. No, that's true. Then again, maybe, maybe not. The world will never know our decision. Everybody's got like 25 pounds and four fish, and they're just slowly calling up the last two. <laughs> We're looking for a home run, boys. Head of the boat that way. <clears throat> that would probably, as professionals as we are, be ideal. Jig in my hand now. Mm -hmm. Ain't no, no more of that ding 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 ding. Space, space, space. This is actually a net, but I guess hide with a scrap. Oh, yeah, we got the back net. Page, page, I promised you. Promise you. you. Got, got this one right there. Magnet. Magnet. Ray 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 Yeah. He is to have a different variety of the same, honestly. This is where most people fail. Internet rig fishing. Yeah, 100%. Is it failing if you never tried? <laughs> Sounds like Hunter.
bait stun go on top water mode. Why did you do that? Look at this. Why did you do that? That'd, That'd be a sick, sick walking bait. Yeah, yeah. foul. Yeah, gun front hook. Go across the lake to the other side, much better structure and cover. Every time we go to the spot he tells us to go to, he tells us to go to a different spot. <laughs> I'm getting confused. I feel like he's just using us as a video game Sims character. I, like, that's what I feel like yeah. right now. I don't know if I really like it. Well, let's just keep it knees. Where I come from, we call that getting jerked around. Not the good type. Not, Not the, the good type. type. He's probably right, though. Mm, there's some pockets, yeah. Oh, look at all that trees. Look at the rock. Yeah, I'll go over there. Let's hit these bushes right here first. Bushes. Lay down full of cormorants. Because, you know, if you see that, that's just fishy water. I think, I think the first thing you need to do whenever fishing your DMV really gets really monetized, gets monetized is only fans. Get with, get your, with uh, your, uh, get with all your, get with all your lol buddies, lol buddies and start pushing for a start pushing for a former and honey. We're at it, put bounty on them. Like, why are they federally protected? Like, are they federally... So many things are federally protected. You know alligators are federally protected? So many things are federally protected. You know alligators are federally protected. Yeah, but there, makes there's, more yeah, but there's more gator now in Florida. Like, you could get molested by a gator. You could get molested, by, could get a molested by a gator at a home. home. At a home. And you can't shoot it. And you can't yeah. shoot it. Yeah. That has gone a little bit too far. That has gone a little bit too far. I don't have any chartreuse crab. No, I got one left. I got one left. Okay, the last one right down here. I brought a box of square bills. Problem is, like, it's five feet deep. Yeah. Square bills. I was literally about to say, just waiting for that afternoon bunk buster. Let's go. It's a keeper. We got a living yeah. boys. Oops. Woo. I do it. Hey, hey, HP. I do HP. it. HP. HP. Dead rig. Now, watch me catch a fish off the same lay down for the clive bait. That is not uh, We got. There's some boys in this house. There's some boys. There's some boys in this house. I think it's time to start playing the music. We have a limit. We can do it one. <sighs> Chat, we're playing music. Yeah. We're coming in, guys, playing some music. But we're going to mute the mics at that point for the music we're going to play. <laughs> yeah, it's going to get real. Real nasty. Hey, dude, uh, you said you couldn't catch a fish off the shore. Huh? You weren't across the lake and not the left, but cover you were in. 
Yes, we were. We were coming from that place. So confused. Because you got to think, too, he's looking at the camera from a different angle. Oh, that's true. Like, everything's flipped. And that would be funny. Everything looks kind of similar. We've had so many people watching, but the camera was inverted the whole time, so we're upside down. <laughs> I don't know if nobody said anything. No one said a shitty thing, because they're like, you know what? He's got got the downs. You know, they have enough problems. He's got his assistant there with him. It's so hard. He's clocking in hours. It's so hard being him. I keep my wife kept showing me like that Shane Flint skin. He's like, you know, people, people that are always oh, oh. Shane Gillis. Yeah, because his family member. Yeah, and <laughs> she's like living with you. Yeah, <laughs> they're actually pretty cool guys. They're the only one having a good time all the time. Yeah, everyone else is on the air on antidepressants. They're on Capri Suns. <laughs> yeah, they're on Capri Suns and Stone Cold Steve. HP, we got a limit. Oh, your camera timed out. Shit. Might be time to cut the live stream. Unless you think we should keep going. You want to go all day? I got skills. Oh, eight pounder. Ba Boom. Immediately. Thomas making them. Make them at night. <laughs> Where the hell is your thing? All right. All right, guys. So let us know. Do you want us to keep going? You said you were making them at night. <laughs> uh, HP. Oh. <laughs> Let's hit this cove right here, then we can hop over. And after this cast, if you could go turn your camera back on. One last time. Guys, okay, this is gonna be the last pocket, and then we're gonna turn this off, and I'm gonna switch to a GoPro, because we probably do need footage of something if if, uh, if this legend right here next to me finishes this off with a good one. What am I saying? He will. He will. Bye. Bye, catch me down here. As soon as that fish goes in the live well, I'm immediately Googling the nearest gas. <laughs> I mean, come on. I got this one, three, four. Yep. We're good. Ten pounds. Now everybody knows my pass code. Skies, my friend. <laughs> my whole life savings sits behind that passcode. All fifteen dollars of it. Forty dollars. Legitimately, cut a check. I'm just gonna shoot a quick. We cut a check. I'm gonna start shooting in the air. <laughs> if we beat two people, then I'm thinking of. Yeah. <laughs>
All right, everybody. Listen, I am out of battery completely. All the mics are dead, so we are going to be wrapping it up here. Um, we will try to be GoProing the rest of the day so we can have some footage. I'm going to toss my mic over to my friend right here. Uh, say some closing thoughts. We're going looking for Nadine. We'll talk to you later. Right on. All right. See you guys. See it way in. All right. Uh, uh.